evocation, conjuration, divination, like those things, to be like your field of study. Mm -hmm. And then the other ones like war magic and like order of scribes to be like the type of college you went to. Like order of scribes is a turbo nerd college where it's yeah. all like theory and research where war call it where a war wizard like an evocation wizard makes so much sense to be ha to have learned their destructive magic at a war college you're part you're like you're a military wizard that's where you got your start you know what i'm saying yeah. so i feel like it would be like a choice between one of those two and i guess technically blade singer would fit into that category but blade singer is just so fucking broken that everyone would pick it so mm -hmm. that's why i don't include that as an option um and then also like druid i would also have the same thing except to be circle of the land for i do more magic and then circle of the moon for i am furry now as the two options like what your blessing from the god of nature really is is your blessing in your one with nature you become the animals or you get extra magic Hello, you know what i'm saying that. i know we've been back for a little while now this. And all I have to say is, internet crash. <laughs> That's all I gotta say, is that internet died. That's the third time today. He got mm -hmm. animus got powers urged in his room for the third time. Hopefully, Twice. it's not gonna be too much different. I sure hope it doesn't Bro, become a problem. Bro, what is he running that's eating up all the power? <laughs> you know, <laughs> just the normal stuff. Ah, uh, the normal stuff. Because whatever it is, it's fucking surging your fucking... What are they? The the box. Whatever it's called. I forgot what it's called. Uh, uh, I doubt it's the breaker box, because that okay. wouldn't turn itself back on. It's just yeah. 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 <laughs> anyway. Uh I guess we can start now. Bad day. Marber. Let's see. Last time, uh who all was the ones who looked by who looked back and saw the child? It's Carlia. Oh, I, I think it was it only was... Carlia. It was me and Roy's um uh, my still defender was the thing that noticed, and then yeah. it was po trying to point it out to me, but my character didn't give a shit. Like, yeah. hey, master, <laughs> master, we got something behind us. It doesn't have a voice. It cannot speak. <laughs> That's what it was gesturing as, though. It was like, oi, you blind motherfucker, <laughs> with your one perception. You blind son of a bitch. Notice. Look. That's the other thing with losing our fucking cleric is the cleric was the only person with per a comparable perception. perception. We lost our good perception and our plot armor. Well, I mean, I guess it was really her plot armor, but <laughs> indeed, <laughs> uh, it didn't care about you. <laughs> no, clearly not. Great. <laughs> hey, okay. What are we doing? Um. Hmm. Well, I guess you guys return to Roy's shop to plan out your next move. Okay. Before entering the shop or leaving the sewer, I'm going to cast press digitation on myself. Everybody get down. Everyone make a deck save. <laughs> oh, Lord. Get covered in poop. Man's just going to shake. <laughs> I'm joking. Nah, he's not in his wolf form. I reverted, uh, because any more damage, I would have fucking gone berserk. Oh, yeah? Yeah, nice. <laughs> we love that. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's fantasy water hose. It would have been a lot funnier <laughs> if uh, the gloves, instead of giving you prestidigitation, gave you mold earth and uh, shape water. <laughs> and you just use shape water as a hose. <laughs> you just put out your finger, point it at your face, and go. Pfft. It's funny because press digitation, you can make people shit themselves. 
Uh, All right, next. Anyways, make them shit their whole selves. Yes. Bella, right, shit yourself. Thanks, Mac. So the boy, the doggo, or not doggo, is now clean. The not currently doggo. Yes. Is the now no clean. longer, well, currently doggo that is not a doggo right now. Yes. Is Indeed. Schrodinger's doggo. <laughs> is he a doggo or is he not? You'll never know. You won't know until you open the box. The world may never know. You'll never know until you open the coat. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, All right. What are we doing? Stupid joke. <laughs> <laughs> God damn. All right, we are. Uh, well, we were going back to the shop. Uh, there isn't necessarily a whole lot that need be done in this town anymore. Um, I would obviously do some paperwork and like put the money aside for. Paying, uh, rent. But once that's done, I don't think I have anything else in that I need to do here. Because mostly what I'm looking, I need is materials at this point. To get the thing that you want that is going to take a while. Thing. Yes. It is, uh... I will definitely bring the crystal with me, though, uh, For in case we sure. come across them. But I don't think there's anything else that can be acquired here other than potentially, like, mercenary work. So... <laughs> Wait, Slade, quick question. Does uh, dex affect armor in the negative way, too? Uh, I do, yeah, I do, I do believe it does. So if a character was if a creature was wearing a chain shirt per se, if it had a negative dex score, it would be negative. Is chain shirt effect. considered medium or is it considered heavy? I think chain medium. shirt is considered medium, right? Chain mail is heavy. Ch chain shirt is medium. I'm pretty sure it would it would make it it would uh, actually make it it would go down. Yeah. Okay. Full plate doesn't give a shit. Apparently, me eating those uh, 3D things, like, got in my throat. <laughs> got in the wrong place. Nice, you did. Ah! Don't die, DM. Too late. I'm already dead. Ah, uh, fucking world. Well, shit. First collapse. We're playing with a zombie. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Dang. Good question. Carlia, do you have proficiency in, in, in history or religion? Let me check. I think you have, his, yeah, I think you have proficiency in, in history, oh, right? Yeah, Boy, it's windy out there. What about nature? Uh, yeah, I have proficiency in history and religion. Okay. I'm just thinking because in, in the future, I will gain access to two additional proficiencies due to a thing. So yeah. I was just trying to think of what to pick up. <laughs> Yeah. If I what, got a weapon, I'm gonna pick up a rock. If I don't got a weapon, I'm gonna pick up a rock. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna pick up uh, sleight of hand and stealth because I have a plus three in dexterity. <laughs> um, actually, survival is fitting because my character travels so much. But that's a story for another time. Um, yeah, no, uh, I think uh, getting on the road would be the the thing to do. We need to get on the road heading towards uh, Gelman, I think. Yes, it is Gelman. Yes. I. Okay, fine, Mac. <laughs> we'll do things your way. Did Mac thorst you again? Yes. The hell? Oh, God. Mac, don't gonna... drown the DM, please! I'm begging of you! They and it was now 40% hydration. Don't say that, because Mech's yeah. gonna try and get that number to 100%. <laughs> At least... You should put a time limit on that. I do have a time limit. It's five minutes. Oh. You have to wait five Tando minutes has... before you can thirst me again. Tando's body has gone from 70% hydrogen oxide to 
Ninety-two percent. Um. So I'm assuming. Hold on. Yeah, because I don't think anybody has anything in particular to to do here now. You that... wanted to check in with your uh, guardian. Well, yeah, but I'm saying the city that we're currently in. Yeah, there's nothing. Still... There's nothing that you need here. I don't think. I got my stuff. Yeah, it's best if we just. Unless, like, people want to go shopping, I guess, but we are on a little bit of a time Borrowed crunch. time. Yeah. Yeah. You so, guys are currently, yeah. like, what, two or three days into however many days you guys have? I'm assuming it's been at least a week at this point. Like, because it would have taken and... at least two days to travel by boat, by if not more. So, yeah. So, and then when we got here, we slept the night. And so, like, I don't know. I, I don't think I, we probably wouldn't have like, left, like, the exact same day that we killed uh, Argon. So, yeah. <laughs> I need to keep track of how much time has passed. Yeah. Yep. Pretty important. Pretty we, wait, wait. Important. Okay. So if we're we going by that logic, uh, rest before if you we took head two off, days or... to travel. Yeah, yeah, we're definitely going to take. Um, and then one day of rest in town, and then another day of rest. You have gone from 183 to 179. I see. So, um, yeah, we should uh, take a long rest after uh, fucking up the boy. Um, I will, like I said, do the paperwork, and then uh, we should probably set off in the morning. I'm gonna like make I'll a lock the place up. To myself in here. Actually, quick thing I'm going to do. I'm going to modify the lock on my door. <laughs> I'm going to make it so that it, so that uh, if someone tries to pick the lock, uh, the lock will seize. There's a pretty much uh, in uh, it, so you know the pins that uh, you push up. You can actually drill holes in um, the cylinder, uh, or that they have to glide across, so that if there isn't something supporting them, they fall down and lock the. Um, lock in a partially turned position. It's pretty much a. There's you can't open locks like that with picks, and if you try to pick it, it breaks the lock, so that it just can't be opened anymore. <laughs> okay, so I'm putting it. I'm putting just a uh day. I'm putting a note that says days until Argon returns in your guys's notes. I see this. You guys have a hundred and seventy nine days. Right. Is there a way to <clears throat> hold on, I'm gonna see if I can any bigger font. Uh worship call. Just let me know whenever we uh finish the long rest, because then I can whip up something with the shift feet. Or uh Ooh, for snacks. And the wanders. The gloves. As food. We'd probably have to buy rations and shit like that for the road. Actually no, we have we have we have our we we got our own. You guys still got the friggin' belay jerky. However much is left of that, actually. I'm just right. Throw, it's not like yeah. I'm keeping track of you guys' food anyway. That's something that, like, considering there's a party of four of us, of oh, like survival in terms of acquiring food is not necessarily a difficult task. Mm hmm. Especially considering we have a doggo boy that can sniff out, like, wild, like, it has advantage on sniff perception, so he can easily find food. Yes. And we have, we're not fucking animals, we have ranged weapons. Chasing our food is not difficult. <laughs> I mean, a certain somebody would probably disagree with you. 
Well, Oops. I mean, <laughs> I am an animal, you? but like. <laughs> I mean, I'm talking about bad luck. I'm talking about Gearman. Anything that's bigger than a rabbit. From the woods, a holding a bunch of dead mice. <laughs> Thrill of the hunt and all that. Yeah, anything bigger than a fucking rabbit is going to hunt down <laughs> in doggle for I just imagine, like, one of the times we're hunting on the trail, he's, he's like, stalking a pig or something, and then he goes, like, he. He, char- he like dashes out to to run it down, and I just throw the fucking javelin, and it just impales in the head. <laughs> it's like, dude, what the fuck? <laughs> uh, yep. Technology. So you guys took another uh took another rest, right? Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, so quick. that means uh, that down to hundred and seventy. Not only that, I'm gonna fucking make some some food and some snacks for the road and whatnot. Snackaroos, trail mix. Hell yeah. yeah, hell yeah. yeah. The clock <laughs> is ticking. Want... All right, what what do you want me to roll, uh, Tenda? Uh, do you have to roll, roll for that? Do you have to roll it? I don't know. I wouldn't hold believe on, so. Let me, look at you. let me look at your chef's feet. Well, hold on, hold on. He has the chef's feet and the gloves. I don't think either of them require a check. If you want to use the chef tools to, like, make meals and stuff, uh, you would open up the Xanathar tool rules, uh, which gives an expanded list of... uh, You have ingredients and cook utensils on hand. You can prepare enough of this food for a number of creatures equal to four plus your proficiency bonus. At the end of the short rest, any creature who eats the food can spend one or more hit dice to gain hit points an extra 1d8 hit points. Yeah, I don't think it requires any, uh... I don't think it requires any rolls. So you just... Uh... You know what? Let's just add a resource to you that's... Uh... Well, should we actually? Because you have your Wanderers Ensemble gloves. Which, which also gives give me you a, food. Which, yeah, also gives me a... Well, don't, uh, I'm pretty sure with them, it's... He also, uh, like, makes them. It doesn't make them out of magic. Yeah. It makes the things he makes magic hell. So, up to... How long? Cook a number of rations equal to your proficiency bonus to eat that become magical. Okay, um, yeah, I don't think it requires any rolls. All right, then. Yeah, so what your cook's utensils would allow you to do is, like, to replicate, like, specific meals and stuff like that. Like, that that would be, like, a skill check to, like, reproduce, like, like, if a noble was looking for, like, a specific thing, you would be able to attempt to replicate it or just to provide enough food for a regular group of people and stuff like that like yeah i'll I'll send you the link to it before i have it somewhere because my character is eventually going to be proficient with all tools which means having knowledge of what i can do with all of them is important so yeah i'll send Um, it to you eventually make it behind snackos yeah, the man makes fucking breakfast, and then he makes fucking snacks for the road. Trail milk mix and barbecued jerky? <laughs> Essentially, <laughs> yes. Nice, you does. Can't go wrong with trail mix. Bro, trail mix is good. What do you mean? I'm, that's what I'm saying. Uh, fair point. So, we don't have a mungo for the cart anymore, so we're gonna have to buy a horse. Yep. Oh, yeah, you're right. And guess who's driving? Uh, I believe it's only... Uh, hold on, I think it's only like 15 gold for a horse? Let me check. So we D&D. have the spell Summon Steed. Does anyone have the spell? Uh, I don't think they do. Uh, also, I, I think... I'm in an undead, I... but... <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, so there are three options for horses. You can either get a 50 gold draft horse, a 75 gold riding horse, or a 400 gold war horse. I doubt we're going to use a 
riding horse or a war horse, I'd probably just go with a uh, draft, draft horse. horse. Yeah. yeah. Which is 50 gold. Whoever wants to pay for that. And uh, it has the same walking speed as my Steel Defender, so my Steel Defender will just help. But I don't think my Steel Defender is technically strong enough because it doesn't get the size multiplier that a horse would have. Also, I think my Steel Defender only has a 14 strength. Yeah. So... Hmm. Who's going to buy the horse? Horses, uh, horses, horses, come one, come all. We're just, we're just pulling. I got 110 what? gold, so. Uh, I guess, uh, fucking. We can all just pitch in. Because I have well, 145 plus one platinum. It is only. What did I say? 40? <laughs> I mean, I, I wait. It was fifty. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, Christ. Well, if we I all put in twelve, that gets us to forty-eight. I can, I can put the forty. It just, I need someone oh. to put the ten. <clears throat> what was that, bet, bet? I can, I can put the forty. Uh, just need someone to just put ten. <laughs> I mean, I can do that. How all fucked right. would it be if there was a centaur selling horses? A cent, <laughs> like a centaur <laughs> selling horses. That's actually, kind of fucked. Oh my god! <laughs> Weird. That would be funny. Is is the is the dairy farmer gonna be a minotaur? God. <laughs> <laughs> it comes. A lumberjack is like just a fucking treant. <laughs> that is just a... wow. <laughs> now we're getting to slaughter territory. Oh god! <laughs> moving on. We're moving on. Fucking subject. Animal farm. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's basically animal farm in a nutshell. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, true. true. All animals are equal. Are more equal than others. This is true. True, yeah. The the horse seller is a friggin' centaur. <laughs> <laughs> can I Beautiful. interest you in a? Can I interest any of you in a nice horse, or maybe me? <laughs> oh God! No, uh, we're just we're just here for the horse. Oh, ah! Somebody will. <laughs> Me, take me up on the offer someday. All right, what kind of horse are you looking for? What was it called again? Uh, if you're looking for just a draft horse, that's the kind that just pulls cards. We're just looking for a draft horse. Oh, you're like you're in luck. I seem to have just one left. What a surprise! <laughs> Is it fucking lame? Like we look over, it's got mange. <laughs> it's frothing. It's frothing in the mouth. <laughs> oh, I assure like... you, all of my horses are taken are taken good care of. What does the horse look like? Is it cute? What color is it? Uh, I'm just imagining one of the. <clears throat> Oh, paint splatter that. horses, I guess. I don't oh, know what painted. the kind of what's that called? What kind of uh, horse I'm trying to think of. Uh, there's another word for that type of patterning, but I can't remember what it is. Um, uh, yeah. German just walks up to it, gives it a a little bit of a sniff. Just... Piebald. That's what I was thinking of. That's what it's called. What you sniffing for, nerd? I don't know. Does it smell like a horse? Oh, <laughs> like, it's animals. Your friend there is an odd fellow. He. <laughs> he 
I'm just, I'm just not gonna talk to this person. <laughs> I, I'm up, Roy's I'm just like, this is fucked, and he's just gonna fucking. <laughs> 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 Look, if you could sell sell your steel defender, you probably would. Don't lie. Yeah, it would fuck it. I would sell it, and then it would fall apart. And I would just have more money. <laughs> All right, yeah. <laughs> How much for the horse? Mm, Forty-five. Hmm. Make it forty, and you have yourself a deal. <laughs> Okay. Oh, you're trying to have no, me, fuck you. <laughs> what was that, Tendo? Are you trying to haggle? Mayhaps. Hmm. You dare insult the son of a shepherd? <laughs> I like a lot of your jibs, sir. You've got yourself a deal. Oh All my right. god. Well, I was waiting for. I was know. waiting for the traditional haggling pole. <laughs> <laughs> has, has anyone else here seen Ed Ed Nettie? <laughs> oh fucking goddamn it, <laughs> Ralph! <laughs> Ralph! Hello, Ed boy. Hello, Ed boy. Fucking Ralph. Oh fuck, boys! Hello, officer Ed boy? on the table. If you're looking for another horse. Oh yeah. god! It could always be a fucking horse. <laughs> no, just this one. Why? You like give some the the uh what do you call? It's like no, we're good, we're good. <laughs> Suit yourself. On our way now. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Have a just, good day, will you? He just walks out. Just, ugh, just <laughs> gross. <laughs> I was just gonna be like, God, and they said satyrs are sex pests. Weirdo. <laughs> um, uh, oh my god. Like, yeah. German, go, German goes to like, or oh, sets party. So, are y'all gonna name this or not? Uh, I'm not sure how no. long this thing's gonna last. <laughs> I want to make Let my 40 think. gold worth. That's a good name for a horse. Mm -hmm. If I've learned anything from Crit Roll, it's Loonch. I was about to say, if you think <laughs> of it, you have to name it, and it's going to be Loonch. Loonch. <laughs> With an umlaut over the U. <laughs> yeah. Yes! Yes! All right, welcome. L U Loonch. two dots N C H. Yes. <laughs> Loonch. Loonch. Game. I guess. All right. Uh, before <laughs> before fucking, is that what we're gonna name it, or did you want to name it something? Or like, I mean, uh, considering the way that you and me name shit, it's gonna get named like Alejandro or something. Yeah, well, like, <laughs> it's best um, if, if, what if? I'm to think what are horse names? I rode a I, horse once named Gretchen. It's, <laughs> like an I'm letting y'all decide the name. Uh, how, about, how about this? We think about it, and if it lasts long enough, we'll give it a name. If it I makes guess... it the next two sessions. <laughs> yes. Right, yeah, yeah. If it lasts, it is, uh, two sessions, we'll name it's it. It's probably a female horse, honestly. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, we'll keep, we'll fucking mm -hmm. think of a name, and like Slate said, in the next two sessions, if it survives the next two sessions, if it's I'll, I'll try and think of you know how like uh like purebred horses have like those really long pretentious names. Oh yeah, yeah, like a fucking racehorse, like like Challenger Disaster Memory or something. Yeah, like yeah. That. yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. All right. Uh, continuing on, the on. Road again. Back to beyond. Good to be back on the road again. Uh, everyone's just got to. Everyone's just got like, like one like blade of straw in their mouth. <laughs> German is just German is just sitting at the front. A just, blade of straw. Right. Straw. 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 Oh yeah. <laughs> I I heard straw. We're all just got we we're all just like assassins <laughs> with like a dag like a dagger in our mouth holding out like uh, uh, holding onto it. Off to kill Strahd. <laughs> or like one of Strahd's fingernails. Ew. 
gross. Oh, no. God, don't you think, why did you put that image in my mind? Oh, All right, God. we're going <laughs> Carry on. What in the Castlevania? Excuse me. We're so scattered so, today. Uh, so what Bro, I would love a Castlevania setting. Just play through Castlevania Symphony of, Symphony of the Night and just like map the entire thing onto a D and D map. Hell yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh yeah. Yes. That's probably actually yes. been done. And oh, hundred percent. I honestly including the new game the the upside down fucking 101%. Yes, the inverted castle. Mm. Yes. All right. Anyway, uh, we're getting sidetracked. <laughs> Moving on. Yes, yes, yes. Getting sidetracked. Ooh, okay. So uh, what are we so... for players level You guys are level se- 6 or 7. Six. 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 I would just treat us as a level fucking like eight party, considering how strong like our Player features are. Players of medium quality, random. So yeah, like yeah. while he's doing that, like, uh, are we moving Fairy on the card encounter? What's bad? What bad? Are we are we moving like on the cart already? Yes. Or, or, Okay. Yeah, you're, you're on the road. On the. Should this motherfucker make a uh, driving check to not get the fuck lost? And I mean, we're on a road. We're on a road, so I would assume that he's just he's yeah. we're just keeping a good pace. When we have to turn off, is when you're gonna have to start making fucking checks, my dude. Yeah, that'll be fun. Better watch out for the elk. <laughs> it's a fucking deer. Go skinny. Like, Take the meat! We're gonna use that later. How do you get medieval roadkill? It saw you coming for 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Alright. Uh, I don't know if I want to use that creature, because that doesn't make much sense here. Let me guess, it's a fucking green dragon. No. <laughs> a, a goddamn mimic. Oh. Uh, well, I mean... We come, a- we come across, like, a fucking... An actual dead deer, but it's a mimic. It eats the horse. <laughs> we got five miles out of town. No! God damn it! Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> We bury the horse, and the headstone just says, Rest in peace, untitled. <laughs> I need to start. Hyphen, italicized, un- unnamed. I need to start hyphen. removing some of these freaking. Uh, I feel like it's just some of y'all, like German, just driving this one. is a little bit kind of like unnatural. You don't normally see him do anything like that. Eh. Was that natural? Fucking a dog driving a horse. <laughs> I mean, you're a half elf. <laughs> ah, no, go yeah. back. I did not mean to click on that thing. Like, oh. not to derail us once again, but is German kind of technically more of a furry than Crescent Moon would be because she's just like born an animal? But German is an animal sometimes. We're not going to be. We're not going to have this discussion. We're not going to have this discussion. We're talking about it after the session. <laughs> no, we're just not going to have it in general. We're not going to have this discussion. I'm sorry, Karma. You can't control me. <laughs> Look, I. I. We already know that I am, so like. Why does that? Why that was to... my question, though. But it, well, we we can we can talk later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We already know that you're a furry. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, duh. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'm getting rid of some of these things. I'm sorry. All right, I'm just gonna <clears throat> screw it. I think I will. Y'all just get. Friggin' gonna draw a real quick battle map, and y'all just get green. We get green. Oh shit! We get green. I'm allergic to green. 
Y'all just get green. green what color. shade of green is a good color? This is, very, yes, very, this is what... Oh, oops, wrong. I yeah, said draw is shade, more of a yellow mine. green or closer to like a blue green? Aqua maroon. Ew. Aqua maroon. <laughs> 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 I want to see what that color looks like. Y'all get this. Uh, it's probably brown. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, my God, that's so bright. Ah, it's a green screen. <laughs> Quick. Oh, uh, oh God, we got green screened, y'all. Y'all get that kind of green and you don't throw a fit, okay? Oh, I'm leaving my green and I have green. light sensitivity. Bitch. <laughs> That's Apologies. really bright. <laughs> Hold on. I'll, it's I'll... very green. Yes, I agree. I can't this is like toxic one. green. It is aggressively blue and yellow. <laughs> Fine. There. Forest yes! Green. Baby vomit green. <laughs> that is much uh, easier on the eyes. <laughs> I agree. Much, much easier on the eyes. Much less blinding. Indeed. Blinded by the love. I love standing right. in a field. That's my condition, really so, as way. you guys are going across, uh, actually, yeah, I have a cool idea for this encounter now. Yeah. yeah. Just based um, off of this. <clears throat> So, uh, let me get this, this creature specifically. <clears throat> so, uh, as you guys are going down the road, a bunch of, like, a group of giant elk jump in your way. Oh, shit. Hmm. Hmm. German just goes, whoa, there. Licks his chops. <laughs> I mean, hey, elk burgers are good. Specifically, That's true. What seems Very to true. be four. Also, elk jerky is pretty damn good, too. Elk meat good. All right. That's Kenny, did you say giant elk? Giant elk. Uh, aren't they large? Are they? Hold on. Let me look at their character sheet. Oh, no, they're huge. Huge beasts. We're oh. gonna have well, more this, boy. So three this by three. This fully work, does it? <laughs> we have enough space more for good boy. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about, uh, I'm not talking about the elk. The other half of this encounter. Because for whatever reason, when I went through this, it gave me uh, how many of them? That many. <clears throat> okay. I just saw what Carlyle put in the chat. The clock is ticking, and we're making chill. <laughs> yeah, you kind of are. All right, oh, let me man. just put this one on the side screen. I think it's time they well are, in fact, huge. Amazing. Okay, I was not expecting them to be that size. It Ooh. says giant elk. Okay, but the giant crabs are medium-sized, so, like... Yeah! How big is a fucking crab? <laughs> small. Pretty small. <laughs> well, it depends on the kind of crab, because some crabs are smaller. This is true. Like a king crab. A king crab's fucking massive. And then the Yeah, other... now consider how big a fucking elk is. It's like three people. <laughs> true. That's true. Can, can this kind of creature even do this? Aim for either the heart or the head. <laughs> I don't think we can reach either. <laughs> I need a ladder. <laughs> Just take a general aim with the javelin. I think we'll be fine. All right, so... Fucking hmm. German. Here's, slurping. I guess, what we'll do. Uh, <laughs> what you see is two giant... Uh, two giant elk and what... And two... What seem to be younger elk. All babies. Mm. Alright, kill them too. No survivors. But something oh seems kind Damn. of off. Are they spook? These things are slow. Wowza. 
did not realize they'd be slow. <laughs> Holy gazunkus! <laughs> Oh god, oh fuck. <laughs> also, Steel Defender. Oh yeah, I forgot about this about that. Let me grab your suit the old Steel Defender out. I already got the goes I'm also this. Gonna make these. Make sure they always whisper that. Oh my right, god. So hey, little baby, just, let me whisper in your ear. Something that might just like to hear. Just, uh, real quick. Obviously, I didn't, but we didn't stop right in front of these things because they'll kill the horse. Yeah. Okay, Protect the, the horse. You know? <laughs> wow, one of these things really rolled poorly. Oh! <laughs> <gasps> Jeez! And then another one rolled really well. Why? A whole, a whole three. <laughs> nice, you guess. All right, I guess uh, roll your initiatives, too, so we can see what goes down. Uh, yeah, before fucking anything happened. Yeah. Don't want to do the your trash. horse was, like, you saw them stopped in the middle of the road, and you just, like, stop your horse. Yeah, and then he hopped out, sees that, transforms. Just so. Trying to Miss spook him! Segundo. Uh, okay, yeah, it should have. I was just making sure that I might still defend another raid on HP. Oh my god! I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm gonna click my character and roll my bad initiative. Hell yeah! <laughs> you okay, that was actually decent for me. I go before him, though. Jesus. Do you have a higher initiative? Oh my god! <laughs> Why? I mean, I still have, I still have Gift fuck? of Alacrity, hang on. That's true. It's wow, that's so much better. Six. <laughs> oh my so god, three was gonna be six. <laughs> six, six, six. Oh god. What the? Wow. Okay. So. Oh my good thing sure today is. Today is looking sure. interesting. I'm pretty sure I go before what do we call it, Slade, mm. and Slade goes before Carlia. Yeah. What? So. Sad. Yeah. There we go. It's reordered into its correct organization. Oh dear. This song's the only one that rolled a number. Yeah. <laughs> Look, if we add if we add Decent. one and one together and then add her dexterity, she would also have a six. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. Look, it's five, four, three, two. Now we just need someone with a one. <laughs> uh, all right. So, uh, first one that goes is this one. Hmm. Yeah. Who doth uh, attack it? Uh, it's not far enough away. Because that's only ten. So I guess... Huh? It can do this... And then come charging in. Alright. Oh, bye, God. Bye, 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 Carla. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Karma. Yeah, Carla straightforward uh, toward a target, then hits it with a ram attack on the same turn. Alright, so it's gonna make a ram attack. Oh, no. Oh, oh my. Oh my. I don't think that hits. I'm so, yeah, because my armor class is 17 with, with mage armor. 
which I would have done. So yeah, it doesn't hit. Oh, and you uh, so you would have used your arcane recovery to get slots back, right? Yeah. So you can cast three first level spells uh, at the um beginning of a day then and still use your arcane recovery because you can recover a number of spell slots up to half your level so would you have used gift of alacrity on an additional creature oh am i able to do that yeah gift of alacrity can be cast on other creatures as well Who oh would you uh, give it to? Sure. um roy <laughs> all right what i get uh, t- fuck Come on! No, are you I, 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 that would just mean I would go before bad. That's all it would do. No. No. Alright, fix your oh. thing and then I'll reorder it. Yeah. Oh my god! I would have had to have rolled... Actually, it wouldn't have even fucking mattered. If I rolled an 8, it would have still put me... Um, that is incredibly sad. Yeah, I would have still only just gone before the cat. That's all it would have done. Yeah. There was no hope of me beating them in the initiative. God damn it. <laughs> okay. Fuck. And that's all the giant elk can do. Next one. One of these smaller boys. This one. Can you even move that far? Hold on. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It's going to start up right. here, see some lovely meat, shape change into an amorphous form, something that it... <clears throat> uh, wait. Okay, so... Uh, yeah. I guess it doesn't transform. It just kind of stays in its form and does this. Oh, shit. Slade, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Roy. Oh no! It not twentyed. Uh, that's oh, a shame God. because my steel defender would have used its reaction. <laughs> All right, What's the right. other number? <laughs> oh God! <laughs> Doesn't hit. <laughs> <laughs> my steel defender has exactly two things it can do: it can punch people and it can interpose itself between attacks. <sighs> Good. There. <laughs> Hell yeah, you funky little suit of armor! It just fucking it just it, it did like hit, hit with any force, but like it was coming up and it just like put its foot out against its head and pushed it away so that right. the charge <laughs> missed. <laughs> fucking try that <net> twenty me. <laughs> All right. They, do they have range? Oh, they do have reach. Oh, boy. This one, it's not going to do the same thing as its friend here. It's going to attack. It's going to attempt to uh, use... It's going to ram into, uh, into Roy. Mm, mm-hmm. Too bad a 17 doesn't hit. I gave... I gave Roy too high of an armor class. I can't hit anything. I also have shield, so I can burn <laughs> spell slots to say no. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Crescent, you first. Croissant. Croissant. Oh God. Hang on. The 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 laptop has decided to do me a bad. And mm. fucking decided to load itself. So this is fantastic. Anyways. Why? Just cause. Bruh. The world hates fucking. you. No, no, no. So so while mid-loading, mid-loading on the laptop, I decided to pull my phone out just for the roll 20. And um, suddenly the laptop decides to fucking work. Why? <laughs> Wow. Anyway. I'm gonna move over here real fast. And we's gonna use Yes. 
Yes, mm-hmm. indeed. Mm-hmm. Good soup. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. Does your uh, steel defender do weapon attacks? It yes, it does. Okay. So, towards this motherfucker, uh, I'm gonna gonna do this. Well, not too bad. Sadly, does not hit. It's fine, I made my attempt. Uh, then I'm gonna... I'm gonna do it again. Do it again, okay. Holy shit! Fucking... (laughs) What the fuck? Also, uh, roll 2d4. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. (laughs) Oh god! Okay. Wow. Oh. This is fine. <laughs> so this is going to be uh that much minus eleven in total. Yeah, it's gonna be eleven. Yeah. Okay. She rolled really bad on the damage. Yeah. Not she my best a day. Fucking, a one a fucking Two, a one, and a two. Guys, I think our luck might yeah. not be very good today. I think so too. This we'll time this it's not my goes. fault. I didn't yeah. light the Loki candle today, so I don't know what the fuck. All right, so that was your turn, yes? Yes. Roy, your turn. Okay. Uh. This could be quite dangerous. Depend. Actually, okay. So I'm gonna use my action. Cast a spell. Y'all know what it is. Y'all know how it do. Make a DC 16 oh, yeah. Dexterity saving throw for all of them except for this one. Okay. So need to. Hell do yeah! Hell yeah! Only one is 16, right? DC 16. Yeah, that one's... That one fails. That one fails. They all fail! Woo! Alright, <laughs> now my Steel Defender is going to... Uh... It's gonna move here using 10 feet of its movement. Which, this one's gonna get an attack of opportunity, so go ahead. Okay. Well, doesn't matter. It got a nine. Okay, and it's going to use uh, the remaining 30 feet of movement to move back to this spot, which will drag this one into this space, forcing it to make a DC 16 dexterity saving throw. Actually, it needs to make a grapple a grapple check. Okay, so that thing needs to uh, give either a Athletics or an acrobatics check. Contested, it has to be to 16. 20. Uh, Ooh. silvery barbs, fuck you. <laughs> okay. 15. Alright, I win! <laughs> gonna move him back here and he's gonna be put into that spot. Now make a dexterity saving throw, DC 16. 19. Oh my god. What'd you say? 19. Fuck! Okay, so that one, this one specifically is not restrained. The rest are. Uh, and I'm gonna give bad luck, because, you know, he's gonna be making attack rolls. You get advantage on your next thingamathang, my dude. Alright. I mean, he already gets uh, advantage. I mean, yeah, but he doesn't get advantage against uh, this one. True. Carlia, oh wait, well, actually, was that your turn? Yeah, it's still my turn. Right. But my Steel Defender is still grappling this one, so it actually, I'm really tempted to move into this space and just burn this thing's reaction, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to move here. Okay. Uh, do a ram. Twelve. I'm going to bat it away like, fuck up. <laughs> Now Corloya can move on her turn without getting attacks of opportunity. That's true. 
I was thinking. Mm -hmm. I mean, well, yeah, that's true. You could have gone mm -hmm. one farther because, like, reach of ten feet. Yeah, no, it's not. That's not the reason. I'm putting it so that I'm within range of my steel defenders so that it can impose disadvantage. Yeah. On attacks, at least against the two smaller ones. I mean, I already basically stated what these two things are. I was thinking about do doing a funky lightning bolt, but I don't want to set Roy's web on fire. Lightning will not set it on fire. Yeah, lightning will not. Fire will. It says that it will. Uh, it does why does it say that it would? The lightning ignites flammable objects in the area that aren't being worn or carried. Oh, that's fair. Okay. Yeah. I didn't realize lightning bolt specifically said that. Yeah. Uh, and your only other option is fire. Yeah, that's I mean, cool. unless... Because uh, my only other, uh, I, I don't imagine I'd be able to, to twist it around enough to say that I could use necrotic damage from my summon undead, since it's technically from the summon, not the spell itself, so. Yeah. Uh, um, man, we, uh, are there even any other options when it comes to, uh, like, that I mean, stuff? You I mean, you you could use these. you could use Melf's Spidoot Meteors with lightning. I could do that, yeah. Uh, but or like he's trying to imply, you could use I don't know your summon on dead because that lasts an hour. Yeah, that's also what I was thinking. Was well, just... you also don't technically need high level spells for a freaking weak encounter like this. What's your point? Okay, you want me to just fucking magic missile it, Mr. DM? You could. <laughs> I could. Uh... You could also rhyme is binding ice them so that they have to use an action. They have to use an action to get out of the web, and they have to use an action to get out of the ice. That is pretty good. You have to angle <laughs> it in such a way, though, that it doesn't hit, like, everybody. Uh, I mean, she could, like, it's a 15-foot cone, right? Yeah. I mean, where she is now, she could probably right, hit yeah. this one and, like, get the, this face. Maybe. No. Actually, I don't think it is possible to hit all of them with the way they're oriented. Because it is... Wait, it's a 30-foot cone, right? Uh, let me double-check. Because you could move into this space and hit all of them. Foot. Yeah, you'd be able to move into this space and hit all of oh, them. Here. Oh, yeah, because... Because okay, yeah. it would start, it would originate in this corner, and it would travel out to this way, right. and also up this way. Yeah. So, okay, that I'm would that would intersect that. with all of their spaces. Boink. Oh boy. So that is... Constitution saving throw. Okay. It is. Sadly, it's not dex. If it was dex, it'd be hilarious, because they'd have disadvantage, because they're restrained. Right. Okay, so, uh, let me... All four of them need to make a con save. Well, if we ever want to set them on fire, lightning bolt is dex. <laughs> What's your uh, spell save, DC? 14. Well, that's a four. <laughs> that's an 11. <laughs> that's an out oh. one. <laughs> and only one what? of oh. them succeeded. Still Which happy. one? Which one? <laughs> is uh, it one of the big boys? It, it was one of the big boys, because it's a giant Nice, because he's already restrained. <laughs> yeah, I, it's probably this one. Alright, so... The... Uh, roll I think it's damage. 3d8. Holy shit! Alright, so one takes 8, and the other ones take uh, 16. Now they are th those ones that uh, failed are double stuck. I just realized you could have made that psychic damage, so it's not that they can't move because they're stuck to the ground. They can't move because their brains don't work. <laughs> oh, wait, oh my god, that's hilarious! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see why this encounter would is uh, labeled the way it is. Because oh. I did not realize that these two boys were meat bags. Mm -hmm. So, 
I'll need you to count it twice because both of them failed. And then as for the last one, that one minus 12 is... All right. Damage calculated. There we go. And I don't have any bonus actions I can take because I didn't do one of my bonus bonus action spells. So that's it for me. Okay. I should guess. Do your wolfy things. All right. I use my bonus action. D6. Crimson right. Take four. Take this. And then... I could flank and then be able to attack two. Uh, I mean, you'd be able to move up adjacent to me and just attack uh, this one and that one. This one. There you go. This is true. Alright, then. Yep. I'll just move there. Then attack the left one first. Okay. Uh, let's see if this hits. Mm -hmm. 19. 22, actually. 22, because I get advantage. Yeah, so that definitely hits. I forgot how much damage you can do with a power attack. Goodness gracious. He just rolls all the dice. That's the thing. <laughs> Minus how much damage was that? 21? Indeed. You just halved one of their HPs. In one strike. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> On the same one? I mean... It's up to you, Chief! <laughs> it's already ain't going anywhere! <laughs> that is true! I might as well just hit the big one, because that one really can't move! Alright. Uh... Fuck it, we'll do another power. 24! The fact that you always roll, like, fucking 19 is ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. Like, how? This is like, this is like fucking Goresh when he's rolling, like, an Arcana check. Outside of combat. Alright, that's 26. Against the big one? Or the same yeah. one? Yeah. The big one. Uh, let's Cause... see. This one's already taken damage. That half, it's, well, it's not a half, but you can't move, might as well take advantage of it. Congratulations. It's dead! Uh, yeah, that one's dead. One shot! <laughs> nice! I, I hey, watched two shot the creature. Power the eyes. Packs, my guys. Indeed. I don't think I, no, I can't do anything else because I already used my bonus action. Alright, I'm done. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, this one. Draw your last pathetic card, Yugi. Mm. Let's see. <laughs> this one. What's it gonna do? Bad boy, bad boy. What's it gonna do? What's it gonna do when I come for you? Alright, so I guess it's going to attack your steel defender. Nice choice. 21. Yes. It takes 11 bludgeoning damage. And. It also gets counter grappled. So basically, what you see happen is when, uh, when the deer thing goes in for like a, uh, well, when the elk looking thing goes in for a bite or something, it just kind of lashes onto it. I see, does. You're just going to hear a crunch of metal as it, like, bends the cheap sheet metal armor. Actually, no, it's not cheap metal armor. That's actually plus fucking one armor. <laughs> That's good shit. Yeah, you'd be real sad to lose that one. I mean, I don't care if the steel defender dies. I just need to recover the armor. Yeah. <laughs> we can mend it, don't worry. Alright, that's the end of that one's turn. As for this one, 
Ah, cripe. It still doesn't have... This one... You have your... Well, we have your reaction right now. I still... The Fender has its reaction. Yeah, so that's not good. <laughs> it's I mean, I don't know which one you're referring to, because if it's the one in the back, I mean, still the Fender can't do anything with that. I mean, it, it, it's this one. I guess it's going to attempt to... Okay, never mind. Nat one. No matter what, it fails. I died. I should have used my fucking blood benedict. Forgot I still have that. Forget it. The more, the closer you get to being a necromancer, the less you use your necromancer abilities. I forget <laughs> I have. <laughs> been alive. Yeah, that's the, that's, that's the one feature that you tend to, you always forget that you have. All right, giant elk time. Oh god, the big How bad the coward? Prepare thyself for an 18. On whomst? On you. Too bad. <laughs> oh shit. You gotta roll better than that, big boy. <laughs> Kill it, I can take control of it. You need that on the die, bitch! Oh my god. Crescent moon. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so, let's see. Hmm. Be careful. Be careful, Garamon. On your turn, when you move, you may accidentally create attacks of opportunity. Okay. Go I'm try gonna... Again. That's all I gotta say. Move over to here. Okay. Ah, you beat me too. Damn it. <sighs> And this motherfucker okay. is going to get slashed. It's going to, to slash. be smacked. By the he way, uh, Croissant, if you had moved to here using your feline movement, you would have been flanking. Oh, wait. Yeah, that would have been a plus two, plus advantage. All right. So this one takes 13. Indeed, it do. All right. <laughs> it does do that now, doesn't it, though? Bravo, go. Again. And then we're gonna do it again. Oh, God. That's a miss. Fuck. <laughs> you know what? This is fine. This is fine. This is Sadly, fine. You can't do because... power attacks for bonus attacks. Mm -hmm. Bonus action attacks. Indeed, so indeed. Swing your your hand. Kitty <laughs> claw. That rule was a little thing. That rule was a question. Oh, do that. Six. You very consistently roll six. I don't know how. <laughs> this is true. I I, I, I I don't know how either. All right, Dave. Are you wanting <laughs> I to don't do even a know. flurry of blows, or is that it? Uh, I guess it's gonna be a flurry of blows. Alright, one more. I'm gonna do this again. That's oh. a hit. Hurt me, <laughs> sister. <laughs> Hurt me, you, s you silly, silly sow. Ah, uh, stop. No. Not the fucking centaur. <laughs> <laughs> and that is all for me. <laughs> Roy's turn again. Woohoo! All right, now for... Okay, so I'm going to go after the one that isn't restrained. Wait, that one had its turn, didn't it? Yeah, it just ha it barely had its turn. Okay, make a deck save. I forgot about that. It's, it's still in the web. 18. So, and four I'm not using a spell on that. Um, well... I'll let him continue not, uh, being stuck, and uh, I'm gonna kill this one instead. Oh. Um, I'm going to go for the eyes. Did I hit? Mm -hmm. <laughs> 17. Oh, wait, I forgot. Hey. You've been it. I forgot to be counting. Uh... God damn it, I forgot to be counting advantage because. 
Oh, wait, that one wasn't, that one's not restrained by the web, so it wasn't an advantage. Yeah, the one on the left isn't restrained, it just yeah. can't move. Alright, so... <laughs> Good lord. Alright. We gonna do it again? Is it alive? Yes. <laughs> I'm not going to, but my steel defender is. <laughs> So the Advantage. 17 hit. Yes. 13. No. It is dead. You see it transform Yay. from a deer to some sort of amorphous blob as it kind of just... Oh like, god, it was a ditto. Uh, <laughs> I'm not using my hand to put a dick on it. <laughs> it's not worth it. Um, hmm. I kind of want to pull the one out and put it back in the web so it has to make another deck save. <laughs> <laughs> My steel defender will use 10 feet of movement to step one step back to pull it out of the web and then take five, another 10 feet to move it back in. <laughs> make a deck save. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get his suck at 19. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Fuck. Kiss my ass. <laughs> I gotta get a plus one to my to my saving throw DCs. <laughs> All right, let's see how much you like life. 26. <laughs> Fuck you. Yep. Oh, I don't have advantage. It's only a 17. God damn it. <laughs> 18. It was a 1! I would have rolled a 1 on the fucking crit! <laughs> I didn't lose much! <laughs> oh my god. Alright, you cheeky fucker. Alright, right. well, congrats. It, it also. It survived with 1. No. Oh man, that would be really funny. It turns into a pile of goop. A goop. Oh my god. Hmm. It would have been so funny if it survived with a one. Oh my god, that would have been <laughs> the best. <laughs> oh, god. <laughs> <laughs> you cheeky bastard. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's, if it starts its turn, or the first time it enters the area on its turn. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Now you know how barbarians do so much damage at high level. They don't do damage by attacking. They drag people in and out of spirit guardians. <laughs> with their monstrous fucking strength score. So no <laughs> one can beat them in a grapple check. I will move on my turn to move you in and out. Then I will hold my action to move in and out again. On your turn. <laughs> Carlia. There's only a boy left. Yeah, uh, it's just a boy. Should I burn the web now? <laughs> You could. Uh, I mean, what do you want? it's up to you, Grill. Mm, do you have any second level fire spells? Let me. I don't think I do, which is tragic. It just um, drops a fire. Yeah, back. Flaming Sphere was the one that I really would have been really fitting because you could have made it an ice sphere. Yeah. Just drops a friggin' fireball. I mean, if I wanted to use a like low level spell, I could do Burning Hands if I get close enough to the web itself, but that wouldn't uh, be You hit. are within range to hit it with a, with a burning hands. It's a, it's a cone. It's a 15 oh, foot yeah. cone. Oh, yeah. Again, right. just because the people yeah. in crit roll fucking, you, like, always put their hands against someone doesn't mean it's actually a touch spell. No, I, I got understand. it. I got it mixed up with a fucking, that one, uh, fucking grass. grass whatever, yeah. Oh, okay. So yeah, I'll do all all fireball. Hands. Burning hands. Burn it. Burn in holy fire. How much fire damage is no. this going to take? I think 3d6. It's got to make a dex save, but it is in a web. So it's at disadvantage. Five. Yeah, it's still stuck. <laughs> Roll the 3d6, my girl. Oh, well, there's a 1 in there, but could be worse. A 12. And then add the 5 damage from the web starting to burn as well. Or was it 2d4 or was it 5? I can't remember. I know oil is 5, a flat 5. I don't remember if... At your spell card. 
Sam. No. Roll up. Uh, <laughs> 2d4. I'll roll the bang. Roll your 2d4. Middle of the road, both times. A 4. So that did 16. All right. But the web remains until the end of... Uh, until, uh... I think it's... Isn't it the end of my next turn? Uh, it's at some point uh, on a preceding turn, on a following turn. A so creature is said if the web exposed. Else you can do on your turn. No, that's pretty much it. Gearman, yep. what you do, son? Movie and then hitting. Movie then hitting. Okay. Smack. Just cool. don't. Just don't walk into the fire. I'm not. Yeah, don't don't burn yourself. We don't need a toasty doggo. Eh. That it smells like burning dog. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this thing out of its misery. Who says it's in misery? Uh, it is on fire. I have a 15. I am in misery. Okay, you hit. Okay. Good lord. 23. Well, congratulations. It is dead. Nice. We've done it. We <laughs> the thing. Ooh, cooked giant elk. Oh yeah, let me make sure I actually. I saw I saw the co the twenty two on the Constitution saving throw from right after I cast Web, and I'm like, oh, did he crit? <laughs> <laughs> I saw green. You saw the. Green. All right, guys. I used one of my most powerful spell slots. Yeah, I was going. I was going to use uh, a spell. Might of the going, abyss. Nah. Yeah, yeah. hold on to that shit. Hold on to that shit. If she actually gets serious, we'll need to use my slots more efficiently. I only have one more web for the day. Oh, I gotta dude. teach the oh, wizard no. web. Hell yeah! It's gonna cost me a metric awesome fuckload of gold, though. I don't <laughs> doubt it. Like. First level spells, cheap. Easy. Not a problem. Second level spells, ah, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like an entire order of magnitude more expensive. It's like 250 gold to make a a, 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 um, a second level spell scroll. Man. A first level spell is only 50 gold. So, yeah, it, it's fucking rough out here. How do you guys... Being, like I'm realizing now how powerful power attacks actually are. They make martial characters actually deal damage. Cause like, oh my god, those things uh the giant elks alone had forty two HP. And the other creatures Forty two HP there. ain't a lot of HP, my guy. Like, I consider mean, bad is... luck from the other game with one firebolt could easily deal like eighteen damage. Eh, yeah, like true. if we had if we had a draconic sorcerer that actually played like really aggressively, they would have quicken spell and twin spell, and he would have fired off a quicken spell, scorching ray, and then he would have fucking twinned a firebolt and killed like two of them on round one. Meta magic. Yep. <laughs> Meta memes. I'm actually gonna pick up quicken spell because it's actually really good. It is. Bonus action fucking spells. Anyways, all the yeah. yeah. Uh. Yeah, Germany's Ger Ger gonna revert. All right. Gonna go back. Gonna fucking. You gotta take a short rest then, my guy. Yeah. Which, pretty sure we're gonna end up doing it. Hope we don't get attacked by their friends. Eh. How oh, God. out of a sight. Take that a lot was of short rest. We take a lot of nap. Two mimics acting as children to giant elk. I feel like we should. <laughs> also. Mm. My mix. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Also, I'm going to, uh... Or bad shit, actually. Are you gonna harvest some venison? Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, I'm gonna, like, get some of the meat off of the fucking... Just carve even, out a one cubic meter you know, of fucking <laughs> deer if meat. If we don't eat it all, we could probably sell it, too, to get some gold for, you know, things like... Spells? This is true. <laughs> Or that whatever 65 we need. is probably from the one that got caught on fire. 
It's already cooked. And the other one, <laughs> and the eighty nine percent is probably from the one that got partially cooked. Indeed. Cool. Yeah. How do you? How do you? They got freezer like burnt. <laughs> they all got actually. This meat's probably fucked because they got fucking yeah, that's a good frozen point. and they got set on fire. <laughs> You know, it's like just not you have to get rid of the first like three out. inches of 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 meat. Like you just have to like shave off layers. <laughs> it's like, uh, oh, we finally got some good meat that yeah, isn't fucking. I was about to say fucking garbage is just there. They're huge oh, though. So. They, yeah. the they are huge. They are fucking enormous. Yeah, but yeah, you just fucking carving out some of the meat. Just, ah, such a waste. We also weren't able to bleed the meat because they're so fucking big we can't hang them from a tree. So, this meat's gonna be real gamey, my guys. Bro, <laughs> next time I'll try to use cells that'll make it taste better, I guess. Hold on, <laughs> press the digitation. Compress I don't know if press the digitation works on the inside of things. I think it only works on the surface. Yeah. And we're trying to get the blood out of it. <laughs> I don't know. We will settle with our regular fucking food. I don't think we're gonna get turn a profit on everything we kill. Now, now goblins, on the other hand, I hear goblin ear soup is a whole fucking thing. <laughs> I'm completely <laughs> fucking kidding. It's like shark fin <laughs> soup, except <laughs> goblins. We come across a fucking village of goblins that none of them have ears, and they're just terrified of people. <laughs> God. <laughs> <laughs> That's dark. Or they're just terrified of hags. Like, I'd imagine this is thing hags would do. Like, it, oh, yeah. like there's a hag industrial complex where they just harvest, like, ingredients. Real quick, oh, uh, real quick oh, I need chill, warm, or flavor up to one cubic foot of non-living material for an hour. So you're just gonna cut the, the cut it into, like, one foot, like, cubes of meat? Essentially, yeah. Meat cubes, meat cubes. Yeah. Bro, if we if we get enough of them, we could totally open a restaurant for fucking storm giants. The meat cubes are just the meat in the ramen. <laughs> Essentially. Yes. Right, we're, no, we're getting second. So, yeah. Anyway. I'm always get... thinking of other career opportunities once this is over. Exterminators, <laughs> restaurant owners. Yeah, it's, it's just like, near, you know. Uh, yeah. The first fact is says this is like. The following magical effects with it. I'll just put it in fucking the thing. What am I doing? And with that, I think that ends that day. So. Alright. Tick down to a 177. I'm taking the antlers. You're taking the Ooh, antlers? What are you use those? For? Sure. Uh, yeah, I'm going to soft the antlers. Wait, I gotta put a jacket on. You're gonna my... take your artisan's tools and... You need to make a... You need, need, you need, to, be, need to make a check? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, what you have which one should I use? I'd probably use woodcarver's tools because that's the closest thing to that. So, not true. Uh, what do you want? Strength or dex? I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go say hi to my uncle real quick. He he came in from Florida, so yeah. Want me to convince the antlers to come off with charisma? <laughs> Dexterity. I feel like sawing through. Okay, there you go. Oh, my oh nice! God. I get all of the antlers, and I package them away <laughs> into bundles. Like, I cut them into, like, the right sizes to where they're really, like, convenient to use, and, like, they're the perfect size for working into, like, tool handles and, like, all that other good shit. My, it's perfect. It's immaculate. Is what do you have planned for these for? I don't! I just, I'm just taking them for, war, war, like, Working material. Okay. It's fucking antler. Antler's used in fucking everything. Is there anything you want to do with those mimics? I mean, I, I'd have to like do an arcana. Ch I know they have acid in them, but like, I don't know if they're. Do they have anything in them? They're not. They weren't formed into chest. They were formed into deer, fucking meat things. I mean, I imagine. Considering the object that you want to create with that magic crystal. Fine, I'll do a fucking invest. God damn it. I mean, that's not very good. So right, It's not I very good. Also, hey, by the way, I didn't. Hold on, hold on. I didn't. Did I add my artist's intuition to the last one? Hold I on. Did not. Hold on. 
I got a tw- I got a thirty one on my uh on my antlers check. There you go. <laughs> you, just, you just walk up to them. You barely touch them with your saw, and they just pop right off. <laughs> I just walk up to them. I grab the antler, and I just tap them with a with the fuck with a fucking wrench, and they just break off in a perfectly like even cut, <laughs> like. No sawing. It's just like I, they just crack off. Like it's a perfectly smooth cut. Come off with like a <laughs> comically audible pop sound. <laughs> it's like I just, yeah, it's I a mean, trick. Uh, what yeah, what I actually do is I like is like I wrap my index finger and my thumb around it, and then I just like snap my finger. Like I shoot el- like energy through it to just like break it using magic. <laughs> I would just imagine. No, no, no. I, I imagine the comment is, "Huh, must be shedding season." Yeah, I was about to say. <laughs> It's probably like the season. Do I find anything with the with the? Hey, does anyone else want to do an investigation? I should ask for help to get advantage before this. It's too late for that now, though. I mean, Kendall, what does the weather look like? <laughs> God damn it! Uh, clear skies. What's it gonna look like in the next twenty four hours? <laughs> yes, also that. <laughs> probably you can see a roll of clouds coming in. <laughs> Gary just goes, eh, it's getting cloudy. No, like you cast you cast Druidcraft and it's just like it shows like a like a sunny like a bright little moat of light, but then you'll see like blue appear and it's like you just see like cl- like the like the almost a perfect fucking like like uh pick like what's it called again? The um uh like the stupid like cartoony art they use on like the weather channel for like oh, the yeah. storm clouds and the rain. Yeah. Just, yeah. It it, it it like forms and like appears over the sun, and like you see like little blue streaks falling out of the sun. <laughs> it's just a weather broadcast. <laughs> uh, looks like this could be Hi, right welcome far. to Druid's Art Druid Craft. All right, today on. on the news. Well, here's today's weather forecast. Uh, welcome to, to Fox. Be... <laughs> welcome uh, to Fox One. <laughs> there appears Why to be. Not? Rain coming in. Is that what comes through the druid craft? Like Slade, imagine this with your uh m- with your tool that you're wanting to create. Mimic skin, considering it can take shape of anything, could be useful. Could be useful. Could be. It is interesting that there are mimics in the woods. It's a if little it's hard. odd that there is. I must say. I will take it. Does it? Okay, so using a similar trick with the antlers thing. If I put energy into the, like, if I just, like, send magic through the, like, surface of the mimic skin, does it react in any sort of way? Does it, like, flex and tense, like, fucking frog legs with salt? Uh, Arcana check. Uh, I need to do it. Fucking twenty four, well twenty eight plus four, so I got oh a thirty two. <laughs> yes. <laughs> like <laughs> I'm like just I'm just like ridiculously fluent with like using mundane magic. <laughs> I carved these bitches up too. It's it's like a fucking f- I, I just fillet these things at this point. Yeah. I I completely separate everything apart into like what's useful, what's not, what I can get reagents out of. I don't miss a fucking bit. Unless you want me to make a a, a I I, I don't really think there is a I well leather workers you. tools. I won't make you cuz you already did you already got a nat 20 on your artisans check as well as your arcana. What the hell? <laughs> And a net, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and a perfect four on your artisan's intuition. Look, I'm really good at very specific things. <laughs> like when it comes to making shit, my character is a fucking god. Apparently, I mean that's kind of part of his name, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, for that's a thing for later for all the other players. So, uh. Just for a little flavor, when you put, like, when you put your hand onto the mimic skin and pulse magic into it, what are you imagining, like, trying to create? 
like mainly what I'm doing is I'm just seeing like if it like moves and flexes in such a way that like I can effectively control it by using like magic circuits effectively. Like I, like effectively like a um like those uh fabrics that respond to electrical currents and like flex and move based on different electrical impulses. I'm doing the yeah. same thing except with magic. Well, when you, I guess what happens is, like, it flexes and uh, it does the things that you want it to, as well as, like, you feel the texture of it, like, change from a leathery to more of a, like, bark mm. kind of feel. Does it also, For like, split move kind of like a fluid, like it, like, can separate and reconstitute? Yeah. Sick. Is this it? I didn't even plan on this, but there you go. There's a part of what you wanted to create. I still feel like I need, like, a core to it. Like, some, like, hard magical metal. Yeah. Regardless. So this is what's going to make up, like, the soft parts and also, like, the handle and all that other stuff. Like, like not, well, not the handle, the grip. Yeah, just right? like the... Just like the leather wrapped grip. Anything that you hold on to, like, it'll... It, like, anything that needs to be soft or need to be hold on to or, like, that needs to make, like, a sack or, like, vessel of some kind mm -hmm. that isn't made of crystal, you know? Yeah. So it's gonna be, like, super duper, can be whatever the fuck I want at, by the end of this. But I need a magic metal. Yes. Metal, leather, and crystal. Once I get that last piece, we'll be golden. I'm gonna become a god! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You can see my character's just, like, he's just, like, fucking magic like sparking out of his fingers like it's all coming together <laughs> y'all no one will make fun of me now y'all kind of cower in fear as you're just like, watching him slowly devolves into palpatine no <laughs> no it slowly turns into kevin oh god <laughs> anyways i've taken up too much of the session at this point yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Next bit. <laughs> Continuing down the road. Eventually, the road. due to yeah. how horses are, you have to take a rest. I steal the fender, will shake his head. He was like, I thought we were the same. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad it's not a mechanical horse. Fucking pathetic! <laughs> Slowly dissolving into a tech priest. Flesh is weak. The flesh is, is it, weak. Is it, is it dark or is it still day? Like, you travel throughout the day and then by nightfall, it has the horse is just like really tired. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, we can only travel for eight hours, ten hours if we're going to be doing a forced march. So. Yeah, Ger Germany just go looks at the horse and just stops and he just goes, We should set up some we should set up camp. We shouldn't go any further. Get a rest. Mm. Wise choice. Not mm. a bad idea. Yeah. He gets down. He unties the horse from the thing. Like he feels to tie it like I don't know. Have it tied around like a tree or something. Hmm. Do I want to do something I had an idea for, or do I want to not? Do it, bitch. Come at me. I mean, I mean it's just more side Truly, that is up to you. Plans. I mean, you as a DM have ultimate say, so like... I think I just might. <clears throat> uh, who takes first watch? Uh, my character oh, is going to be is going to be up, just working on the, uh, like just like studying my uh, materials. So I'll take first watch. Okay. By the way, my steel defender doesn't sleep, so it's always on guard. Hmm. <laughs> and I would have repaired it by the way while we were writing. <laughs> Get back hmm. this. 11 hit points. What do I have in terms of these creatures? I'll take second watch. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> you guys <laughs> having like uh having friggin <laughs> a steel defender makes it hard for me to do something. I mean, it only has a passive perception of 16 and dark vision up to 60 feet. <laughs> and can't be you surprised. Know. <laughs> just, just usual things. The only thing is, is its strength is not too great. Nah, its strength is only 14. Um... Hmm, how do I want to do this, though? I don't know, but I'll, uh, I'm honestly... a short rest. I'll get back my fucking transformation. Yeah. I, I would consider, like, the setting up camp and everything to be, like, a short rest. Yeah, yeah. and then the rest of it is... Huh. 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 I have no idea on how I want to do this. <laughs> I mean, you could have my Steel Defender roll a perception. It could definitely fail. <laughs> well, it, it <laughs> passive perception takes priority over a perception check. Uh, if someone's trying to sneak up on us, the Steel Defender's passive perception, they'd have to beat that. Okay. <laughs> like, the, the entire group of creatures need to beat it's still it's perception check in order to get surprise on us. Okay. Um What kind of roll is stealth? It's a stealth roll, which is dex. 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 Yeah, I was about to say it's a dex roll. Oh boy. Alright, I'm gonna now actually I'm gonna only roll this once. Gonna roll this once. Gonna hide rolls though, so they don't pick up on what I'm doing. <clears throat> yes. Mm, yes. Well, uh, good luck <laughs> on beating that one. It got a oh, twenty. Uh, it got a twenty-one. Mm. My. Well, that definitely beats its passive. <laughs> Sneaky fucker. Don't kill the horse! We've only had it for a day! What about your Still trying to come up to pretend to beat yours? A hundred percent it beats my passive. My perception's dog shit. Alright. <laughs> What's my perception? It's one. I have a passive perception of eleven. <clears throat> oh boy. Oh boy, I this is fun. Since you I'm also this. distracted. You took first watch. Everyone else is basically asleep, right? As. All right. Well, <laughs> what occurs is y'all got kidnapped. What? Huh? You wake up. I mean, next, you y'all wake up the next morning in a bunch of cages. Ah, oh, shit! Here we go again. <laughs> Girl, Do I have my tools? <laughs> Uh, probably not. Not on you, at least. Hmm. Does anyone in the party have Mage Hand? <laughs> yes. This uh, feels familiar. Yes, I do. And hmm. you wake up and you appear to be in some sort of tent. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Hey, hey boss, it looks like the Yumi's are awake. Question. Actually, Since I no, did only least... one of you is actually a human, so like that's not even correct. <laughs> no, I mean, human? That is partial human. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a They're all, we're all considered humanoids. We still technically took a long rest, right? Yes, you did. Okay. Just making sure I got my spells. Yeah. Uh German just pipes up and he goes, I swear to whatever holy being is out there. If you don't let me out of here, I will rip this cage apart. And oh, you included. Oh, what? What will you do? Like he... And Gerber just begins to, like, fluff up. Just, like, begins to, like, slowly transform. Why don't you get too closer to the cage and I can show you? Uh, I'm looking at what this kind of thing has... 
Yeah. Nothing Real good. Quick. Okay. <laughs> Actually, uh, hold on. Can I really quickly? Uh, man, this sucks. So I don't have any tools on me, right? No. Guys, I literally can't do anything. Mm. You can't get yourselves out of this cage. All right. So, uh, yeah, bad luck. Let's see. What kind of save? Do you if you're going to make. Yeah, wisdom save. Um, what's a what's a normal what's wisdom saves normally? Oh, I mean, what creature? What is it? Well, you guys are in a in a place with a bunch of orcs, so an orc eye of Groomsh. Uh, what's his spellcasting? I don't know. It's check oh, his it's stat a, block. It's eleven. Okay, spell save DC is eleven. That ain't gonna be hard for you to beat. No, it's uh, especially since I have. Roll Ed yourself magic. a wisdom save. I think it's a magic. Hold on, let me check. I want to. I want to make sure. I don't think I do, but. I don't know if this is gonna work either. If. Because like he's going to say the single word, sleep. No, uh. Because I, I have resistance against. Well, I can't sleep. I'm immune to being asleep. Because of my, uh... Well, like, yeah, I'm fantasy. meaning it's like, oh. doesn't... can't. Well, don't you revert back if you fall unconscious? I can, you can't. Uh, fan ancestry. I'm immune to, uh... Being He's immune to spells that put him to sleep. Oh, yeah. okay. I don't know. Um, <laughs> so, I guess... What yeah, other ways but... can I get him to fall asleep? You can't. <laughs> You'd have to beat him up enough for him to fall unconscious. You'd have to start making <laughs> or death get, saves. Or uh, revert back, to revert forms back to normal. Yeah. So, I guess, yeah, fucking German is just gonna, since he's pissed off because he's been put in a cage again, how big's the cage? That's a good question. Oh, that is a very good question. <laughs> um... I'm assuming since they only saw fucking German as the small human being that he is, it would be like a small cage, I'm assuming. Like a medium. Size enough for him, I guess. Oh, you want to fight, eh? Don't worry, like, you'll oh. get your chance. Real quick, also, what type of sh uh, shackles are they? Are they metal? Are they wood? I mean, they're a I was assuming they're metal. They're a war band of orcs. What kind of things do you think they have? Mm. They yeah. would have stolen them, so they'd be metal. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. Like, they can use human things. They just can't make them. <laughs> anyway, just a bunch of pig-nosed orcs. Fucking. Christ. Yeah, That's not a thing in this universe. Fuck. <laughs> German just goes... As soon as I'm out of here, every last Fantasy one of you are gonna be my dinner. You just sit there. Oh, just in annoyance. I'm He's extremely mad. If the other party looks in my direction, you're gonna see my character's very uncomfortable with the situation because I am completely out of my depth right now. Mm. Like, unless I like, I don't think I would have explained this to anyone in the party beforehand. <gasps> but I can't oh. cast spells without tools. Like, I yeah. physically cannot so, cast any magic. So, yeah, as he's, like, talking up the... Just talking. Uh, German is, like, casting mending on, like, the shackles that he has on. Wait, why would you mend them? Because I can... I can, uh... You can't oh, mend no. something in reverse. It only fixes yeah. things. <laughs> I misread that. My bad. You're, you're looking for the knock spell, which is a second level spell. That's the one. I mean, like, I'm gonna kill I guess you if you guys, wanted also, to, let me you could try and make a straight <laughs> check to see if you can break the chains. Okay, because I was gonna transform and do that. Just break out of the cage. If the cage was I mean, small. I that's one way to do it, I guess. Well, guess they're all awake now. I guess it's time. Then you, it's then you notice that they have like, uh, y'all are on kind of like, 
You know those things that are used for carrying, like, seats and stuff for royalty? Kind of? Mm -hmm. Oh, they, no! They in those. <laughs> hmm. Okay, then. Ah. Uh... <clears throat> and then they carry you out. To they carry, carry bad specifically, or the entire party? They carry the entire party out. And when you go out, you find yourselves in kind of a weird sight. A large arena. From, like, wall to wall, you see, like... What? Well, from in the stands of said arena, you see orcs. Just all cheering. And in the center of the ring, you see a relatively large orc. Gurmy just, like, under his breath, he just goes, So we're all entertainment for a clown. Entertainment for a clown? Who says use entertainment? What? Can I... Do we, is okay, so are we in the arena right now? Yeah. Okay, is there like is there like weapons or anything like that? Or is there like That's a, a fucking question. is there like is there like wooden <laughs> sticks or something? Can I like break off like a quarter staff off of something? <laughs> I was about to I was about to say I literally this. can't do anything with my bare hands. <laughs> I if I can get an, a, a weapon of some kind, I can. I do have one spell I can cast, Great and that's spell. magic weapon, because uh, I can cast as a racial, a racial trait, which uh, at least gives me a weapon. <laughs> can true. I make a perception to see if he has the keys on him? Because I'm pretty sure I can use mage hands to, like, fucking nick the keys off of him. Uh... I mean, he would see it. Like, Mage Hand is not a subtle spell. No, it is uh, not. Then, never mind. Uh, he doesn't... I can tell you right now, he's not the one who has the keys. Fair enough. Yeah, I wouldn't assume so. Use. Well, I guess you is entertainment. But I'm not your opponent. So it's a fight to the death. Not really. We're just seeing how long you can survive. <laughs> I'm wondering what kind of creature they would capture. By the way, is my steel defender anywhere nearby? <laughs> I mean, they probably saw your steel defender too, and was like, "That's yeah, not gonna roll here." They and they capture it too. I wanna, I wanna try something really quick. What you got? I'm gonna put my hand, like, up to my mouth, like, two fingers, and I'm gonna whistle. Can I allow my strength, my steel defender, to <laughs> attempt a strength check to break out of whatever it's in? I don't think it's gonna reach us. I just want it to make chaos. Alright, do it. <laughs> uh, so I'll whistle. Nothing, we're not gonna get any feedback from this, but... A roll. It, it did. It failed. It, yeah, it fucking yeah, failed. It failed. Tando! Tando! Question. Can I have the little skeletons attempt to pick lock the fucking shackles? <laughs> they oh my god. They don't have efficiencies in anything and they don't have tools. <laughs> I mean, they're just gonna use their hands to like, I'm pretty pretty sure they're just gonna feel around and just fucking what do something. you just do? Bones. Fucking... Uh -huh. A pa a fucking bones just fall out of his pocket and just start yeah. <laughs> start fucking they, with the lock. They just fall. And just, they stop. They they fall apart again when he looks. <laughs> he's really, like nothing. Really doing something to like nerf your party here. He's like, hmm. I don't like you. Yeah. He, what? I don't want Feelings to do that again. So he just like tells has one of his like subordinates wrap a cloth around your mouth so you're gagged <laughs> he gives him like that look just oh 
We're having no, no, fun. No, no, not you. Oh. Not, not Gearman. Roy. Oh, Roy. Gotcha. Fuck you. Oh. <laughs> oh. And you, you got us. You had a spell book when we found you. No! God. I heard it. People like you can use your voice to cast some spells. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, smart one, huh? I heard that orcs were pretty Here dumb. we go. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! And then he, he has the uh, orc people do the same thing to Carlia. No, okay. Weird question. I know I'm not normally the attacky type, but I do. I am a dragonborn. I don't know how if this would necessarily work. Can I try and fucking bite at them when they try to put it on me? I mean, you could try to probably do your breath weapon. I was about to say. Oh, yeah. Uh. Oh, you know where the fuck not? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Worse acid when you need it. This, uh, they got. They got to do uh, con save. I mean, I imagining that there's like two of them doing it. So con save one, fifteen. Con save two, thirteen. So okay, let me see what the actual save on this is. And then, just for Eight. good measure, the uh, the war chief. I'm just trying to rile these fuckers up. Okay, I'm gonna make a copy of these and then just buff up some of their stats for the war chief. Like, for instance, uh, oop, I had that. Actually, Bust. technically, I can cast Misty Step and, uh, Silvery Barbs without Spell Slot, without, uh, my tools, because I actually get granted those without, uh, the tool requirement feature, because that's only for artificial spells. Okay. I think those are good enough. So what Ooh, what did they roll? Uh hold on. Two of the one of them rolled a 13, the other one rolled a 15. As for the war okay. chief, he rolls a 13 as well. Okay, the two that rolled a 13 failed cuz they needed to match 14. So what is that? Uh that's 3d6 damage. Hang on. Boink. Wow, you're a feisty little one, aren't you? <laughs> I'm not little, reminder. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, to rile Remember, them up more, because... This guy I'm, is... I'm... Uh, the war chief is pretty tall for an orc. How tall is tall? Like, probably close to the same height as you. Mm. Maybe a bit taller. I guess I am probably skinnier than him, so... Hey, yes. Tendo. I'm gonna do this last attempt, and then I'm gonna stop, because if I rile them up more, <laughs> shit's gonna happen, and I'm not sure if it's gonna be a negative way. So that's gonna be my last attempt at doing something. Okay. I'm gonna eye of a new... Man, game. guys, my plan from the fucking start was for you to mage hand the fucking... my shit over to me, so I could actually break out of here. But yeah. I can't do anything right now. <laughs> yeah. So, Who's ready wanna... for... So... <laughs> Who's ready German... for a massacre? So German's gonna look at the war chief, and um, he's gonna just... I have Anubis. Um, What's I have Anubis do? This... Here you go, chief. Uh, Make a ranged spell attack. It's a 14. You'll be able to beat it. It's just... Yeah. Is it even a? It's an attack roll. That's not like a save. Like, did you already oh. roll your attack roll? Oh shit! I didn't yeah, know that. I thought roll it was a safe. range attack roll. All right. That still misses. Yeah, it's roll again because it's two attacks. Oh shit! Memory. I have Anubis is two separate oh. attacks. Oh. Twenty-four. Okay, that one hits. I didn't do anything to buff his defense. Take five to chronic. Okay. Listen. Now he can't take the disengage action. It doesn't matter. It's just fucking 
Fuck so, you. Uh, it has gonna... what kind of components? It's just material. Uh, what is it? It says uh, components are material. Yes. Yeah. You have a spell casting focus. Yes. Do you have it on you? Pretty sure. I mean, I don't have mine. I mean, unless they fucking took the fucking lantern. <laughs> Pretty fire. <laughs> it wouldn't be lit, though. It'd just be... It wouldn't even be lit. Yeah, it's so only... they probably didn't notice it, at least. Unless yeah. you kept it with your stuff when you slept. No. It things... Uh, fucking... Always on me. Hold on, Tendo, am I wearing my gear? Like, my armor, at least? You're wearing your clothes, yes. My clothes have my armor in it. Yes, Like, exactly. incorporated in it. Well, if I'm wearing my clothes, my inside of my coat is all tools! Is it? <laughs> yes, yeah. I've established this before! <laughs> my inside of my coat is literally, like, all tools. Like, it's like, if I open them up, I look like a fucking drug dealer for, from a fucking, from a fucking uh, hardware store. That's true. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> Just, what tools you need? I've established them up. <laughs> I've said this multiple times. When I, when I go to use to right. tools, I pull them out of this big fucking, not big coat, it's like a regular coat, but like, <laughs> I've got like awls and files and a whole bunch of shit in there. And I've got my fucking thieves tools hidden in my fucking socks. <laughs> like, <laughs> you can't be walking around with fucking thieves tools. That's just dangerous. <laughs> fucking, what you call? Like that's why I'm like, they have found all of my shit. What the fuck? I carry all of the hidden tools things. on me at any given I time. I have that. fucking, I have fucking Smith's tools, leather workers' tools, tinkers' tools, thieves' tools, and woodcarver's tools. So, on me at all times. <laughs> so okay. what are we doing before this dude fucking takes the five necrotic? Well, I'm still trying to find a monster. That would be okay. Oh, so are they? So are they looking um, at the cage, or are they just fucking talking to each other, not paying attention? So Tando, can we say that they took my thieves' tools, but I can't lockpick this shit? But they yeah. didn't take my like regular. Woodcarver's tools? Yeah. Because they wouldn't know that shit, that I can use it as a, as a focus. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. Um... Like, I, like, from the start, I was put off, because I, re I was reaching for my lockpicks, and I'm like, the fuck? Fuck! <laughs> Alright, who can speak El- who understands Elven? Uh, I think I speak Dwarvish and Gnomish. Damn yeah, I speak no mission dwarvish. I don't speak elven. Yeah, I speak no. common. No, I'm trying to speak a language that these fuckers won't know. I mean, I know common and undercommon, but that's about it. <laughs> undercommon is just el is just elvish with a fucking uh with an Australian accent. That's all. <laughs> Friggin' a blink dog. No. <laughs> How do they get that? And then. The Dragonborn knows common and draconic, I'm assuming. Me and the Blink Dog have a one on one fight. It literally just looks like a fucking Dragon Ball Z fight as we just keep teleporting around. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to transform in this cage. I'm going to be honest. Oh. I'm, a I'm avoiding that. Understandable. Because oh. okay. one. I can probably break okay, out I'm the back. shackles if I did. Mm -mm. And the cage, mm -hmm. but especially. I mean, they the want to, like, <laughs> humiliate. So I'm, I'm tempted to use this creature and just reflavor it instead of. Well, flavor it as an orc champion. Hmm. Did they take my spell book? Yes. yes. Mm. Uh, you would have access to um, the spells that you had prepared the previous day. Yeah, just none of the... Okay. Yeah, okay. Um, probably gonna, like, not have it be as strong as it is already. But, like... 
a champion. How does that make you feel? I'm just gonna repurpose this. Repurpose this thing. If only if I had advantage, it would have been a crit. <laughs> it would have made a difference, though. That would have been funny. Okay, repurpose. Take a dish. Drop it there. They've kind of got you guys lined up. <clears throat> All right. Well, I guess he is your opponent then. Gonna re repurpose this. The same battle. Oh, we're, we're in cages. Are we shackled? Uh, no. Okay. So as when we break out, I'll whip out a fucking uh all, and I'll just fucking cut this whatever they have in my fucking mouth off. But right now, my character's just keeping. He's keeping quiet. To not <laughs> irritate them any fucking more. Mighty Mo. Which one shall? Do they open that cage? Which bow shall I cut? Oh. That's a bit Man. unfortunate for you. I'm in the other room who got picked. <clears throat> he points his sword at the dragonborn. Fuck. Now, I'm gonna give you one chance to arm yourself. Because I don't... I fight fair. My character's just gonna chuckle to himself slightly. Yeah. <laughs> like... Uh, I'm gonna... Uh... I'm gonna cast Might of the Abyss. Uh, she doesn't use weapons. I know. But I'm pretty sure yeah. your still your still defender is like out of reach. Yeah, it's it's, it's not here. Reach. It's not here. Okay. Don't yeah. just forget that's there. Um I, 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 I need to the calculate the damage that he's already taken. <clears throat> Cause he took eight from the breath attack. Yep. Five, five he's a little the... profty. Yeah, and then five from the the which we call it. And then one for the Eye of Anubis. Yeah, five. I'm biding my fucking time. <laughs> yeah. Ger German is gonna, like... And as he points his sword at the cage, just like the, uh... The orcs that are accompanying him open it, will unlock the cage in which Carly is in, and just, like, push her out of it. And then they put the rest of you guys on the sidelines. Yeah. Now before before they uh which, yeah before they fucking move us he's gonna cast my other best real quick. Ah, oh, but it won't work because uh I'm not sure how far we'll be away. Who's ready for a massacre? Is uh is Corloya now out of the cage? Yes. Okay. Well, that's a shame for him. Why? Uh, I'm gonna pull an all out of my uh, out from in my coat, which is normally used for wood carving, and I'm going to fucking slash at whatever's on my fucking face. Do I make an attack roll? Uh. To cut this off. Yeah. Why not? All right. Let's not hit myself. Where's a? I don't have a fucking dagger. It would be. Plus my dex, so what would it be? Total would come to uh, plus three, plus three, so plus six. So 20 plus six. The d20 plus six. So it would be a 13 to hit. Do I cut the thing off? Mm, what do I the motionless it? fucking object? Yeah, I guess you do. Okay. I'm gonna fucking Misty step out. <laughs> hell yeah, Where hell to? yeah. Right I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna be like, you're right. It will be a fucking massacre, and I'm gonna use my other attack to to fucking stab him, using it as a dagger. Oh, let me add a dagger to my inventory. <laughs> Come on, it's just a regular dagger. 
I'm using it as an improvised weapon, but it would just be a fucking... Do I hit him with a 16? Uh, no. Well, fuck him. I will next time. <laughs> well. Ain't that interesting. Well. I'm not against fighting two at once. More fair for me. <laughs> He's gonna just make a good old swing at you. That's a fucking mess. Obviously. <laughs> I'm assuming I don't have my shield, so my armor class is only 18 right now. Oh my god! <laughs> a fucking 20. Fuck you, Silvery Barbs! Oh, that's initiative! Oh, uh, no, okay. Yeah. I mean, I can technically, uh, can technically Silvery Barbs initiative rolls, but no. Um, and I guess he'll do. I guess he'll do his second one now as well, which is also a miss. Orloya, do you want to have your turn initiative? You should roll. Yeah, just roll your thing. Cause you're out of the cage. How long does it take to cast mage armor? It's an action. It's an action. Also, yeah. does it have verbal components? Cause she's still got the covering on her mouth. It does, unfortunately. So. So your armor class is low. I yeah, can help on the sideline. I can cast shit. This is true. You do have spells. Um, so if you want me which to leaves me with a quandary. Who do I who do I help first in the party? So I guess he was kind of like closer here, so I'll move you closer. Alright. So he gets to go again. And I guess what he'll do is just give himself a good old-fashioned double strike against the one who smacked him on the back. Well, I'm definitely gonna fucking Silvery Barb as one of those. Alright. Because even if I cast shield, I wouldn't Oh shit, he gets block. three attacks. Fuck. He gets three attacks? Fuck. Wait, do I have my gauntlet? That's the question here. Like, did they take that off me? Like, the full sleeve gauntlet? I don't think they realized what it was. What it is? Yeah. Okay, then I'm gonna shield spell instead. And block every single one of those. No, I can't block the 28. The 28 would hit. Okay. Alright, that's 20. Okay. That fucking stings. Why does... Hold on. Why why does it do it? Huh? It can slashing well, 12 plus 7 slashing damage. Oh, it doesn't take the 7. Oh, okay, the, the 7 show. is if the, Yeah, yeah, no. So I I take 13. Half. I think I take 13. So that would be Well, the target takes the secondary slashing damage the creature has if the champion has more than half of its total hit points remaining. So Oh, okay, yeah. so if he has more than half, so I would take the, uh, 20, okay, okay. I might take that second damage off, Nah, though. leave it. We'll see sure. how long he lasts. Are you sure? I mean, it's gonna be a 4v, a 4v1 here in a second. Okay. Gorlia, your thorn. Mm. By the way, can Bad reach him through the cage? No. Hmm. Just barely so, out of reach. I'm guessing I'd probably need to take an action to get the dang thing off my mouth, right? I mean, it takes, like, probably five seconds to... Well, not five seconds, but, like, less than an action to pull it off. Okay, so I'd say be bonus action? That. Yeah, gonna, or maybe just an item interaction. Uh, I was gonna say, I could just cast a mage hand and just take it off. Okay, well, because I, I only have, like, a few spells that don't have verbal components um and those where i'm at right now i would not be able to cast them without also hurting roy which i don't want to do so all right i mean a lightning bolt wouldn't hit me you can straight. thread the needle straight here <laughs> yes here, uh, that's just an extra thing components. do you want to try and whistle for your steel defender again uh i could try <laughs> yeah i don't know if it's gonna break free um do Roll your, uh, do a whistle and roll your Steel Defender's, uh, perception. I guess. 
19. Okay, yeah, that it hears, and it's just like it breaks free of its wherever it's being held. I'm gonna say it's gonna take so, at least two rounds to get to us. Which me, which it's just so happens to be close to all you guys' stuff. <laughs> to know. Its intelligence is only four. It wouldn't grab anything. It's yeah. not that smart. It's just gonna come straight here. <laughs> I mean, actually, you know what? It probably still has your homunculus. You probably still have your homunculus on you. No, I don't. You don't? Uh, I have three infusions that I have active, and yeah. those would be my gauntlet, my returning javelin, and the... I'm pretty sure the oh, spell refueling ring. Ah. Uh. So I would that would be in Carlia's hands. Carlia, by the way, if you feel like it at some point, you can use an action to recover a third level spell slot. Um, so yeah. item interaction, take off the freaking thing. Yeah, I don't so have to do anything for that. Action. I just do it. Waste your bonus. I don't action. use bonus actions anyway. <laughs> yeah, just waste your bonus action on it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Then that's what I'm gonna do, and I will in fact shoot a laser at him. And by that I mean lightning bolt. You're so lucky that, like, it would originate from where you are and go mm -hmm. just this direction and would not hit Roy. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. Is a lot of my other spells that I would be able to do, uh, like, I think Ice Knife doesn't take... Yeah, it's not verbal, so I would have hypothetically been able to do that, but he's within five feet of the... It would have hit you, Gearman, me, and him. Yeah, it would not have gone well. <laughs> Yeah. Hook this man. Guy. Yeah. Shock. Got to got to do a deck save. All right. You're lucky he doesn't have proficiency yeah. in that. Swallows. I am down 17 though. A first. I think that beats it actually. Fuck. Uh I he takes half damage though, so I still get a roll. Okay. What was it? 86. 86, yeah, I forgot how, much, how big the dice roll for that was. It All is right. basically a fucking laser. Hang on. I roll your 86. Also, are you flavoring it as any particular flavor of damage? No, nah, this can be lightning this time. Okay. <laughs> 30. Oh, wow. But he takes half damage. Oh, yeah. So he's fucking 15. lucky. Yeah, 15. So I need to add 16 back onto that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And that's your turn. So, Roy, what you got, son? Uh, I only have two second level slots, so I can't heat metal this guy. God, that would have been funny, but... Um, I'm going to Vortex Warp Bad Luck to here <laughs> as my action. Okay. That's all I got. Let's go! And what about, how far does your Steel Defender move? It can, well, it, it has a movement speed of 40, it can dash to go 80. Okay. So... But if there's, if there's hostile creatures, it's probably gonna use 40 feet of movement, which will outpace most things. And use the disengage actions that it can't. No one can slow it down because yeah. if it didn't disengage, creatures would be able to grapple it as it so ran the first past. First turn, it gets to probably about right here ish. Well, for the next two turns, it's probably going to be remaining here and then using its last one to dash all the way to you guys. All right. So I roll the initiative. Yep. And since f just for yeah, roll it and then it'll immediately be your turn. That's how I'll roll it. Uh, 24. Oh, it doesn't even matter. You are Sorry. already going next anyway. Yeah, so, German, fucking bonus action, uh, yeah, fucking Transformers immediately gets out. He's fucking extremely pissed because he's got to put it in the cage a second time. And I can't activate my Crimson Right, sadly. I have to wait next turn. All right. All right. Predatory Strike. Ah. 16. Sad. Sad. But no. Again, that is a 17. Sad. But no. That is a 26. That one hits. That is a 12. Is that correct? 
Yes. Yeah, because it's it's a regular attack. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Champion. That was a bit shocking. Also, Wolfie Boy. Fuck you. A swing. That's an out one. A swing. And a swing. Nope. <laughs> None of those. You're quite hard. Well, oh, no. The... Uh, except for... Well, you don't have your shield, so... No, I only have the studded leather on. So that'll be an 18. So your armor class is 18, or is it 19? Because of your wolf form. It's 18. Okay, that last one hits then. Yeah. Half damage. Whatever. All right. half 19, that. so that would be 9. And I gotta be keeping in mind half of 143. Damn it, the cages are in the way, so I couldn't even have repelled him away from me. Damn. Could stuff him in a cage. The ca uh, only Carlias is open. Yeah, the other two are closed. And oh. Carlias is also in it. Yeah, she has moved. Shooting lasers from inside a cage. <laughs> <laughs> Her safe space. So. I mean, I could move. 72? Yeah. Okay, I gotta keep that in mind. That's the amount. That's the health threshold I need to reach. Before you guys stop taking that second. Which, considering your damage, you'll reach that soon. Oh, wait. All right, so he's he smacked. Bonus action. He can also just <laughs> recover twenty. So, yep. Fair and balanced. Gotta love the champion. Anybody got chill touch? No. Ah, oh, sadness. Poor lawyer. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Hang on. Hmm. I mean, you could squeeze through bad luck space, take, ha take, uh, um, yeah, he would get an attack of opportunity, though. Would he? Uh, yeah, I don't know if he's through. I really want that, but still currently squeezing. Well, because remember, she would get into, like, this space, or this space, but that would still be her moving out of, uh, his reach. Would it? Because this one is within his reach. Yeah. But, like, that doesn't necessarily I would benefit have to go, her. Like, yeah. Like, the idea is to get out of his reach so that he can't, like, turn and attack the wizard who has no armor class. Maybe maybe you could use the disengage action and then squeeze? She could. I mean, one attack isn't going to kill her, probably. Probably. Um, <laughs> probably. A crit might, but what's the chances of that? <laughs> it's not like that's ever happened before. Uh, mm. Has a fucking giant stick pierced through her. I mean, I am a little bit less squishy than I once was. A little bit. A skosh. I think... Isn't my armor class still a little bit higher because of the fucking... the bracers anyhow? Uh, unless yeah, I you only get 14. Probably... Yeah. I mean, it's not great, but still. I mean, two of his last attacks would have fucking missed you, but he rolled a fucking one and a three. Yeah, and I still don't know what I want to spell I want to do. That's terrifying. His two hit mm -hmm. chains actually is terrifying. <laughs> Look, I wouldn't throw a creature like this at you guys if I didn't think you could handle it. <laughs> and considering I mean... you took down a creature harder than this... I need to actually adjust this dagger because it's a plus one now. Uh, so I think that only does... I think he can only actually do that once. So I should have uh, done it later. Oops. No, you want to do it early to keep him... Unless unless he didn't... Unless he didn't reuse up all those pit points, but you have to remember that if he um, gets below half, he does less damage, so it's in his best interest to um, 
do that sooner rather than later. Yep. So, Carlia, what you gonna do? Uh, I think maybe I will risk using my movement uh, to get out of the cage. Okay. And... Oh, I don't even know where I want to go, though. I mean, hang on. I uh, Just get out of his attack range. Like, over here or something. Oh. Or here. Yeah, just somewhere. Actually, over yeah, here. you're right. Okay. And... Uh, attack opportunity. 19. A 19 would hit. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Established 18 damage. 18 yeah, damage? 18. Okay. Um, now harness your rage! Shoot back! Or shocking grasp him as you run past. <laughs> I mean, it's not like... Actually, he is wearing have... armor, so that would do... Grasp what? on this character. I was just... Wait, do I? No, I don't. I should get that. <laughs> I'm so sorry for our cat friend. He's still stuck. I can only vortex warp one person at a time. Sorry, you said it was 18 damage, right? 18, so... yes. That could certainly be worse. Okay, uh, I think mayhaps I will... Hmm. Maybe I will use Tasha's Mind Whip so that he can do I mean, less... I should be asking his... what your uh, prepared spells are for the day. Mm-hmm. Uh, so uh, I've got uh, Mills Minute Meteors, Summon Undead, Lightning Bolt, Tasha's Mind Whip, Rhymes Binding Ice, Shield, Ice Knife, Burning Hands, and Magic Missile. Okay. Uh, 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 throw, throw, if you were going to cast... Um, uh, do you think that's a lot of spells? Baron has like 23 prepared at any given time. <laughs> it's based off of your level, so... It's based off your level, level and, and uh, intelligence. your intelligence. And I'm a wizard, so I'm smart. <laughs> He's a level 6 wizard with a plus uh, 2. No, what? Plus 4. Plus 3 intelligence. Yay. I mean, I don't have a lock fix, so I can't just Brit pick the lock. I can teleport you out, though. I have to wait a turn, though. I don't have mage hand. I mean, it's about to be your turn. You would just need to wait for Carlia to. Decide. Yeah, yeah. I want to do Tasha's mind whip, so he's got to make an intelligence saving throw. Okay. Good fucking luck, big boy. There's one digit. Got the six. <laughs> he can choose. He's going to use his indomitable feet to try again. That's still a failure. No, isn't it? She's, uh, Carlia, you're, uh, saving DC is 14. Okay, so he succeeds? Yeah, and did I use my reaction this round? I did not use my reaction this round. I could still rebarge <laughs> that. I mean, if you uh, really want to. I don't know how many slots <laughs> I want to burn. Actually, have I used silvery barbs yet today? No. I have not. I have one free use of it. Fuck it, silvery barbs. Fuck you. Roll again. Who are you okay. giving the advantage to? Uh, I'm gonna give it to uh, you, bad. There you go. There's a 12. <laughs> okay, so he get, takes 3d6 psychic damage. 3d6 psychic damage. It's a 9. Oh, okay. uh, uh, you want to throw up the spell card? Yeah. For the it, additional it, effects? Uh, I'm pretty sure one of them is that um... he, he, he has to choose to either move, take an action, or take a bonus action. He can't do all three. He can only do one. For his uh... next turns? Yes. Yes, I and it can't take reactions. Turn. So, yeah. did you do that before you left the cage? Oh, yeah, I probably should have. Uh... Yeah, if you, <laughs> if you reverse your order of things, you would have been fine. <laughs> So did you use that before you left the cage? Yeah, sure, whatever. We can retcon that. If yeah, you time know. is a messy soup. <laughs> Redact redacting the <laughs> damage because he failed that save. That's a mistake that uh, that uh, Karma made, not Carlia. Yeah. yeah. Carlia is smarter than me. <laughs> Indeed. 
All right. So nice, you that's your turn then, right? Uh huh. Okay. Roy's turn. I really yes, wish this man here. would have attacked me. Uh, go here. It is. How far is away is this? Uh, starting on its next turn, it'll be right in this actual position. Okay, so it's not there yet. Yeah. Okay. Uh, mm, mm, mm. I mean, my only real option is to, uh, is to, um, by the way, he can't take reactions, and he can only either move or attack. Bad luck. I would highly recommend being at least five feet away from him on your next fucking turn. After your, why, why the time your turn ends. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Um, I'm going to vortex warp the cat outside of her cage. Where? Uh, outside of his reach. Just outside of his reach? Okay. Yes, and then I'm going to step back to here. <laughs> okay, what's your plan? End of my... T what are you playing? I'm just, I'm just saying, that's the end of my turn. Bad, it's your turn now. Okay, wait, I know what you're gonna do. I'm just telling Bad that it would be a great idea if he just didn't end his turn within reach of him. <laughs> okay, so, Crimson right. Bonus action. Yep. Five. Ouch. Yeesh. Oh. Yeah. Uh, and then... Big By the way, Croissant, do you want to roll your, your initiative? Yeah. There's Eleven. Eleven. Which one right. of you uh, goes first? Uh, she would. She'd go right before me. Okay, so next time, you'll be right there. Twenty-three. That's a hit. Twenty-four. Good Ouch. God. Googly moogly. Sixteen. That's a miss. Okay. And that Nine. one's a hit. Ten. Ooh. Eesh. All right, and then I'm gonna move back one. Whoops. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and then my turn. Okay. Well, you see, it's next turn. Oh, wait, yeah, he can't really do much. He can either move or attack or use a bonus action. <laughs> <laughs> well, Gotcha's Mind Whip. Real good spell. Mm -hmm. Seeing as how nobody's within five feet of him, he's going to shoot a short bow at the wizard. Yay. That hits. I mean, well, even if you used a shield spell, it would still yeah, hit. It would still. And Is then, he above half HP? <laughs> yeah, he's still above half. But he's close. Cringe. He is very close. <clears throat> And, uh, it, does it factor in multi-attack? Uh, can he make the same number of, of ranged attacks as he can with melee attacks? It takes three attacks with its greatsword or its shortbow. So he'd be able to make three attacks. Okay. Sorry, Coralaya. Oh, God. <laughs> That's another. Not as much damage. By the way, is your owl nearby? Uh, what about what would they have done about the owl? I mean, it's a I bird. Mean, your owl is in a place of uh. Well, it's it in, a, in a state of it can be summoned at any point. So, like, what does it matter? I think technically. Uh. Also, how bad are you doing for health now? I don't know. Hang on. <laughs> I'm bad you at numbers. You took 15, then you took 7, then you took 14. Uh. Uh, hang on. Also, I would have assumed that the owl, if it was out, would have just followed us. So, like, I'm assuming, like, it's been circling overhead this entire time. And yeah. the orcs just had no fucking idea that it was. I mean, it's an owl. Familiar. It's not very. It's just a fucking yeah. bird from their perspective. It's not like special looking. It's just an owl. I'm at eight hit points. <laughs> Shit. 
Oh no! I'm gonna toss you my spell storing item. Just grab another tool for my coat and throw it to you. All right. It's Carlisle's turn now. Oh boy. Um. You go behind. You can... you go ahead. A bow, did you? Do I have command? I don't think I have command with this character. She could go behind me and get half cover. <clears throat> Unless that doesn't work. I'm surprised Mech has not been doing more Thors on me. Oh, yeah, Mech messaged me on Discord and said they were having internet problems so they wouldn't be able to watch the rest of the stream. Oh, sad. Tragically, yeah. Yeah, and then they Looking also... For you, you're not going to drown today. Yay. Okay. <laughs> well, well, they told me to make Dre drink a fuck ton, and here I am not. <laughs> I'd rather not drown my DM today. So sorry, <laughs> Mech. Uh... I don't know. I mean, I could. You could touch his really... mind with again. I could. You could. Or I could laser him again. The problem is that since he has range attacks that do almost the same amount of damage, it's not yeah, going to make much of effect for her. I mean, you might be it's able to get him to the point where he can't do that bit of extra damage. She's at 8 That's HP. Insane. One hit will take her out of the fight. True. Mm -hmm. You might want to cast yeah. your mage armor. Also, I gave you my spell storing item. Yeah, is that the. Design? It's got healing. Yes. Yeah. I so... resolved I would just put healing in it until we get the cleric back. Yeah, and then the bird has the snacks. Well, those would have gotten old from la from yesterday. Yeah. Oh, yes. They only last 24 hours. Unless you refresh them every time. Yeah, but remember, we, we he, he has to take a short rest. To make I just realized that you guys are like fighting this guy in like a muddy pit full well in the rain, so it's like a muddy pit. Yeah. Oh yeah, because it was well, the forecast was that it was gonna get rainy. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I told you guys, <laughs> you only get weather when there's a druid in the party that has <laughs> druid craft. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Yeah, so I guess I will just... Uh, I, I will use the healing, obviously, I think. I mean... Well, what I was yeah. saying, what I was getting at is that you, if your owl is nearby, your owl could heal you using its action, and you could cast yeah. Mage Armor on yourself. That's what I was... Yeah, that's that's what I'll do. Alright, how much is your... What's your uh, healing spells? Uh, A D8 plus 5. 1 D8 plus 5. I'll just click the button. Uh, So, if I just hit a Cure Wounds... Uh, it's gonna break, apparently. apparently. <laughs> uh, wow, look at all the healing. Is it even working on your end? No. Alright, so it's eight. Okay. Eight healing. Oh, jeez. Look, I, I didn't say it was good. Can it's just consistent. <laughs> Imagine if, if you had, uh, if you hadn't like, redacted your damage, you would have been downed. Yeah, I would have fucking died, TM. Well, you would have gotten knocked prone. By the way, I highly recommend that if you're gonna try uh, Tasha's Mind Whip, you should drop prone. Why is that? Because ranged attacks on prone targets have disadvantage. And oh, yeah. dropping prone is a free action. By the way, everyone you, when we're using Matasha's Mind Whip should drop prone at the end of their turn if it works. Good to keep in mind. Uh, yeah, I just remembered that I, like, I didn't know if we had ranged attack, so that was lesson learned. So oh. if we do continue to use that spell, that is the tactic. Yeah. Hit gotcha. the fucking dirt. <laughs> <laughs> Don't attacks from the ground, though, have disadvantage? They do, but we can stand up, attack, and then move. Like we, it takes us we, so standing up takes half our movement, which is fifteen, right? We take five feet of movement forward, attack, then five feet of movement back, and then drop to the ground for free. So we use ten feet. We use twenty-five feet of movement. 
What's happening? D&D! Alright, so Carly was healed and cast mage armor, so they're no longer super... So no Tasha's mind whip this turn. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah don't worry about it. Croissant. Alright. What you do? Let's see. Seeing as I don't have any of my other weapons on me, I'm going to move here. And then I'm going to do this. Through the claw. Strike, strike. Yeah, that's a 23. That's. And then I'm going to do it again. <laughs> because I can. All right. Holy shit. By the way, he is nice. down below the threshold. I'd recommend starting strike. <laughs> No. Oh. Kill him. Kill him. Uh, and then I mean, I'm those gonna... Those aren't mutually exclusive. <laughs> Uses mean... all of her key points in one turn to stunning strike on four separate attacks. <laughs> Uses two key points. Well, he four times over. Her key points. It would be one less than her max, because it would be one for the, fur for the furry of blows, and then one key point for each stunning strike. Attempt. So it'd be five of her six. Yes, I'm going to. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do this. It's gonna be stunning strikes. Let's go. Oh God. Okay. This is fine. That does not hit. So I'm gonna try it again. I'm gonna try it again. Fuck. That one hits. Okay. So we're from we're we're all four of those stunning strikes, or. What's the deal? Because, like, you could have stunning strike the first two and then been like, That's... okay, I'm not going to stunning strike anymore if one of them succeeds. Yeah. Yeah. What does he need to do for stunning strike? Constitution saving throw against her con against her uh, monk DC, which is her wisdom plus her proficiency. <laughs> Hold on. What's his fucking bonus? Uh, he has proficiency in this. He gets it's plus a plus six. six. Croissant, what is your stunning strike DC? It is eight plus your proficiency, so a minimum of 11, plus uh, your wisdom modifier. What's your wisdom modifier? Three. Okay, that's not bad. That's a 14. So it's a, the, he has to beat a con save of 14. He's got a plus six. So he has to roll uh, at least an 8. So he's got about a 35% chance to fail. Are you saying that he's silver, silvery barb saying? I am not saying that because I've already used my reaction. Oh, you have. Okay. I silvery barb to uh, his, uh, the wizard's... Uh, yeah. Um, actually... Okay, so how many stunning strikes did you do? Well, only three of her attacks hit, so I think it would just be those three. I don't remember if you have to declare yeah, it before we'll or after the hit. Oh, um, let me hit. check. Yeah, it's just the three that hit. All right, so two more con saves. Jesus. <laughs> what the fuck? Fucking what the fuck? <laughs> Bruh, literally, what the fuck? Of Damn, those six God. results, two of them were below, but they were oh. always on the second dice. God uh. fucking damn it. <laughs> <laughs> but then I'm also just going to move back for a minute. So go uh. ahead and take that if you want. Uh, take that as you will, Drayson. All right. <laughs> Do your turn, Roy. Okay. Um... So... Oh, he already do his, his fucking attack of block for 30? He already used his reaction? He doesn't his, have reaction. He already, had his, he already had his turn, didn't he? So, um, he would have oh, his yeah, reactions have back. Reaction, so, I guess. so just stay within range. Don't, don't step away this time. Stay within range so that when it's on bad luck's turn, he can get the bonus from blanking. But it's not. I mean, it's not I mean, like 15 hits anyway. Yeah, I have 17 AC, so... I mean, do what you're gonna do. You do you, boo. I'm talking to you, Roy. 
Do what you're gonna do. Cause it's your I turn. don't have my javelin, so I have to use my bonus action to cast. Um. Uh. To put to cast magic weapon on my dagger, so my steel defender can only get to here because I can't command it to dash. Um. So next turn it can do something. Um, and then I'm going to take a two stabs with a plus one dagger. Okay. Uh, what's his armor class? Like eighteen. Yeah. These are gonna be uh a little spicy. So I'm going to change it to that. These are power attacks. I didn't change put PA in them because I just added this to my character sheet just now. Uh, great. Two attacks that do terrible. Yeah, no, they don't hit, sadly. Next person. Alright. Alright, guy's gonna, guy's gonna get in there. Do your slaps. Ah, uh, that's hit. a miss. That's a hit. That's twenty-one. Wow. 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 Twenty-three. That hits. That is uh sixteen. Wow. <laughs> He's so close. He's very bloody. Not sure if I should move back or just stay there. I mean, stepping away doesn't really um, grant you any benefit yeah, in this situation. Yeah. I mean, if you step away, if you step away, if you step away, uh, the problem is that you guys would have to have stepped two steps away. Because if you would step two steps away, I would have gotten an attack of opportunity. But, um, or else he'd have to attack me, and I have the highest armor class by a fucking country mile. But All right, he hits Gearman, by the way. Okay. That's what I thought. And you only take the 12, by the way. No more fun. No so I take six. Six. Yep. Yeah. Do it again. All right, so now at one. Nineteen. That hits. But I gotta get my phone. Actually, it's only six, and then this one's only. Is it Seven. eight or nine? Why is it seventeen? What the fuck? He Why? rolled max damage. He oh he's a great sword. Okay, so sixteen plus five. So yeah, oh twelve plus five. So seventeen. So I got that in half. That's Good. eight. Good lordy. So I take eight? You take eight and six. So okay. six from the first attack and eight from the second. Okay, I already took the six. Oh, oh, so close. So close to half? Yeah. I'm two HP off. Did you ever recover your hit points from the uh, vampire encounter? Yes. What about... Uh, Crescent Moon. I, I did, yes. Okay. Yeah, it's 31 for half of 62. Alright. Right. Or, or Loya. Yeah, I'm thinking. Uh, what you go? I could, what you do? I could do Tasha's Mind Whip again. Uh... Or, I mean, if it gets to his turn, right? It, it probably will not. Depending, it just based off of how things are going. An orc never surrenders. Oh, that's a shame. <laughs> yeah, you just go. Neither do I. Could have had a bright future. 
fucking just <laughs> gonna have your head at the end of this. Right, yeah, fuck it. Why, why not? We can do that again. <laughs> Toshos. Yeah. Mind whip. Woo. It's an intelligence save. Yes. Give him brain freeze. Make it cold instead of psychic. <laughs> I could do that. Yeah. That's a fail. He's gonna use his other indomitable. Oh yeah, I forgot you can do that. Fuck. That's worse. <laughs> Never mind. You got one. You got one down. This is why intelligence saves are so fucking good because no one's good at them. <laughs> Hooray for wizardry. Okay. Uh, 3d6. Point. I would recommend drop into the ground. Yeah, and then I was going to go prone wow, immediately after. Uh... So, like, I'm gonna duck the fuck out of the way from this shit. You just, like, he, uh, grabs his head from Natasha's mind whip, and he, you see he is just, like, leaning on his sword now. Hehe. <laughs> I can still fight. I can't shut up. <laughs> Crescent Moon. Alrighty. Just gonna run back over here. And uh, we're gonna try this again. This time, unfortunately, no stunning strikes. Sorry, guys. It's fine. You don't need to worry. Oh, Jesus life. Christ! Fuck! <laughs> wow. It's alright. When it comes to my turn, if you've not killed them, my still defender is going to come in, climb over the cages, and give this man a, a fucking the people's elbow. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh, no. Anyways! Oh! Let's, uh, let's try this again, shall we? Oh. Oh, okay. Hey. That's a mace. Fuck! Well, I'm going prone now. You're not gonna do more? <laughs> I am down to one key point! Okay. I mean, you have your regular bonus action, don't you? Or did she make three yeah. attacks and I didn't see it? That's a, you only did two, you can do a third. For free. <sighs> regular one, yeah. Okay. Bonus attack. All right, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm getting really tired of getting locked in cages. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> that actually hits. Congratulations. You, with your paw, smack him across the face, and he just, like, falls to the ground. Wait, can, can please please make that a please make that a non-lethal. Please. Please. You wanna make it lethal or non-lethal? Just for me. Just for me, make it non-lethal, please. <laughs> Trust me, please. Okay, the thing she, she's, she's she, I'm not gonna make it I'm not gonna make it lethal. It's gonna be non-lethal, but as soon as she sees him get down like fall to his knees, it's just <sighs> Please don't Wait, ever please. lock me in another cage again. Hold on. <laughs> Can I? Oh boy. My steel defender. You're not gonna see it. You're gonna just barely hear the <laughs> clang of it climbing on top of the the cages, <laughs> and then it's just gonna do the fucking move from Pudis engage, <laughs> where the guy jumps into the sky and yes! brings his fucking elbow onto him. He's gonna fucking kill it. Put it's just gonna be a force empowered rend, but it's just gonna fucking it's gonna just jump into the air and come down with an elbow on this fucking man. Yes! Watch out, watch out! <laughs> his neck come is on, cracked kid. as the as the steel his neck and back gets cracked as the steel defender lands on top of him. And with that, the crowd <laughs> roars with excitement. Good fucking German is just gonna fucking in his wolf form just rip it. Or okay, I know we said that it didn't bring the gear, but I kind of like the idea that it like it just like the <laughs> the chest plate like opens like it grabs the chest plate, it stands up, brushes itself off, the chest plate opens a little bit, and just like our stuff just tumbles out. 
<laughs> yeah, like, oh fuck! <laughs> that's why it was so oh. heavy. <laughs> so that's why it took you a while to get here. Okay. <laughs> can this be the thing that happens, or do we have to go get our stuff? I mean, it can be. I I find it interesting. Is it? Yeah. A person can't fit, but I don't think any of us are carrying fucking pole arms. No, my spellbook is the same size as a person, actually. Oh, <laughs> shit, okay. <laughs> what? No. No? <laughs> that that was, fucking spellbook, then. Wow. Holy shit! These fuckers. I'm just gonna have to start hiding shit in you from now on. <laughs> just like, got my shit taken. Just kick this man away. Fuck. I'm assuming the big fuck off uh, cat chieftain is like, oh, what a good show, good show. Oh, fucking jackass. Time for slaughter. <laughs> his I, just can't, like, can't I used that. all my fucking uh, vortex warps on you nerds. I can't vortex warp him down here. I can't fucking pull that trick again. I, I can climb up to him. Damn. I can climb up to him. Good show, good down. show. You God really damn it, another pompous asshole. Tell you what, Cat. we'll let you leave just this once. Mm. Best Do, we kill the chief Do we kill the chieftain? I mean, I'm counting through my spell slots, and I've only got fucking this. three left. Mm. There are likely hundreds of orcs in this one arena. Do you really want to try that? That's true. I mean, we killed their champion. <laughs> it's, I mean... Yeah, that's one. But, one yeah, that's, that, was, that was a 4v1. When I didn't have mage armor. That's true. He did I don't think we want to... I, I don't think we should, uh... Fight a horde just and yet. Bait. And also, we're on a time limit. I think we should try and get back on track. Yes. That's true. I'm so set. Wait. Oh, fucking god damn it. The wizard has the ring. Speaking I was going to say, I was going to. How gonna... many days do we have left now? Holy uh, shit. Hold on. That was probably two I more would say days. Like... like another day or two. I mean, do I have to be. Question. Would I have to be like attuned to the ring, or you could just ask me in uh, I'm pretty sure you have to be attuned to the ring. Damn, so okay. you have 175 days still. Mm -hmm. Okay. I was going to say, because I was going to be like, hey, hey, and I was going to have you pass it to me. I was going to ab absorb the spell slot from it, and I was going to, as we're walking out, I was just going to, like, lean around the, wind the, the corner and just go, and I was going to stab my fingers and cast heat metal on the fucking chieftain and just fucking <laughs> book it. <laughs> <laughs> go 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 go! Who says the chieftain is even wearing metal? Is he wearing a necklace of some kind? Uh, it doesn't matter because I can't probably, do that anyways. Probably, I don't even have the spell of, slots like, for it. Probably, probably one of string and uh, of string and wood. Regardless, I can't do it because I can't even get that spell slot. I only have two. I only have three first level slots left. So those are reserved for if I need to dis the fuck appear. Yep. So gather around your good shit and get fuck out of here. Yeah. Does that guy have any like gear? I'm assuming it's just like orc gear. It's not like of interest. Yeah. It's cheap shit. Cheap stuff. I'm kicking beside and start heading for the gate. Herman just lets out a, a huff. <laughs> just starts walking out in his wolfy form. Wolf boyo. Doggo. I don't know where the door is. I'm just assuming it's to the left. And when you guys get out the <laughs> gate, you just so see like, your horse being held in a pen. Oh, nice and thank safe. God. They didn't eat lunch. <laughs> I think you mean they didn't eat uh, Straightforward Chief, which is the one I just got on this random horse name generator. <laughs> straightforward <laughs> Chief. Or Hilarious <laughs> Wolfgang. That works. That's funny. <laughs> hilarious Wolfgang. 
Why? Lively doodles? I mean, God you literally just call this lustless, horse lustless. spirit. That's right. typical. That's too. That's too. That's that so. Doesn't even that, look like spirit. That's, that's, like, generic, that's like a though. California mother naming her her daughter fucking Autumn or Summer. I agree. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Hope. How about uh, open minded? Allow himself. Why? <laughs> why go the normal name? Oh <laughs> God! Open minded. <laughs> allow himself. God, that's just like <laughs> that's just like HP seventeen seventeen hundred uh, uh like something tech printer or whatever it was. Some fucking Twitch streamer had his so chat name as cat, and it was literally just an HP printer. That's that's how people name like actual show horses. I mean, not ridiculous, but they do have these really weird pretentious names. Well, yeah. who says this is even a purebred <laughs> anyway? Who cares? We want to name it like it's one because <laughs> she's special. He's special. She's, she's, she's got a like, thousand yard stare. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's another one that came up. Dog off. and horse. Gentle uh, refuge. Engaging date. <laughs> Sir Ember. Da helpless. <laughs> da helpless. <laughs> <laughs> Which we call it? Yeah, German is just gonna fucking touch the side of the horse and just fucking speak to it he's like they didn't do anything to you did they just tapped it is your hand still on fire did you accidentally just brand the horse with no. a fucking <laughs> paw print no i reverted no, no i reverted well thank uh, god her, her open-minded <laughs> allow himself <laughs> open-minded allow himself you want me to you want me to roll animal handling to speak with said horse you could i mean Gives me a chance to finally use animal handling at least once. Do it, I guess. <laughs> I got a 14. That's good enough, I say. Okay. I think just every time I'm going to call this horse by a different name. <laughs> Go for oh. it. Oh. <laughs> just keep a catalog of horse names and just call it randomly one Golfing of them. Jubilee. <laughs> call her one of them. Mega Gilda. That's a pretty good one. Alright, so what are we doing now? Well, well I imagine you guys are very confused as to where you are. Yeah, yeah we, we gotta start making survival checks. I have a map. I have a you sniffer. Have a I don't think I have anything that can help with this, actually. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, unless I want to make, like, a history check, but I... I, I doubt it, because you guys were asleep. Most of you were asleep when it happened. That's true. Yeah, And I'm not uh, well-traveled uh, enough to... Also, uh, Cecil's friend is going to be so disappointed in us. How so? Nobody said nobody said the joke line. Ah. Yeah, nobody sorry, said, Vic. Nobody. nobody said, "Are you not entertained?" Sorry. What a shame. That's so tragic. Hey, right, uh, German is going to walk up to Roy, and he's like, "Hey, Roy, you still have that map?" Yeah. She's going to pull it out of a sleeve. Yeah. He he takes it and he looks at it. Uh, let's see. Roll survival. 18. Good enough. Alright. You glance across the horizon, you see the tip, the tippy tops of a mountain range, and you see what looks like the end of a forest ridge line, and you're like, I believe we are hither. <laughs> it, it'll fucking high end fucking British accent. Posh accent. Anyways, yeah. And he points on the map and he just goes, Yeah, so we're here. We deviated from here and whatnot. Hmm. Would this would this be approximately around the juncture where we would have to have made a turn? Or do we need to continue heading north for a couple of Kylo meters? I mean, I'd think you guys would be heading a bit yeah, a bit north and then west. Probably, so. Well, uh, based on the map, we would need to be heading towards a mountain range um, as, like, the landmark in the distance. Yeah. Um, so, uh, hmm. I have do we, attempt, do we attempt to continue on through the woods or attempt to find the road again to continue on 
uh, to spend as little time in the woods as possible. I think it, uh, I think it would be best if we tried finding the road. Fair enough. I want to get Which... too off. Question is, so, yes. how good are we at finding the road? Bad luck is an eighteen at finding the road. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How good are you? About an 18. <laughs> <laughs> Takes only like a couple hours to reach the road from where you are. I see this. We see our stuff, like the, the campsite. I mean, they kind of picked up your entire campsite. Dang. Yeah. Left no trace, huh? Is the cart still there? They took the cart. I believe the cart was the horse. Oh, okay. Is with the horse. Oh, yeah, it's with our dear dear horse. uh, Hang on, where's the tab? I believe it's not a chimera. It's just a horse. It's just a horse. All right, then. (laughs) It's not a deer and a horse. It's just a horse. It's just a horse. Yeah. So, German is going to hop up to the driver's seat. He's just going to wait. He's going to be like, well, I don't have any time to spare. We should get going. All right, for clarity's sake, you guys are going to travel for, like, five days, well, like, about three days north and then uh, two days west, just for clarity's sake, to reach your destination. Mm -hmm. So, eh. Uh, Does Sag need to... So we we are we are a key. Yeah. All right. I, it's not like this is gonna matter too much, but just like once you reach the two days of it, roll a uh, roll for your like driving thing. What what will it be? Uh, uh, you should have uh, land vehicles as a um, proficiency. Yeah, yeah. Vehicles. As... I haven't set to uh, dexterity because. You... Yeah, probably yeah. dexterity. All right then. Oh, I got a fourteen. All right. Uh, one of the days. I would say that we don't go particularly quickly, but we don't get stuck anywhere. Yeah. We don't have any major malfunction. Like we're, we fucking As try to go over a log and get high centered and have to find a way to lift the entire fucking cart over roll for, and spend like four hours. Roll a second time for the second day. Yep. I got a nineteen. And then the second day is a lot smoother. <laughs> yeah. A little rough, and then it just smooths out as, it, as we get closer. And with oh, that, yeah. you reach like the pair of twin statues standing very tall. And with that, so like a river running between them, and they have like headbands and spiky hair. No. <laughs> Not Naruto. Not <laughs> <laughs> Naruto. <laughs> In between yeah, Ger- there's like a it's like a gate that leads mm. nowhere. Yeah, German just goes, Hey, I think we reached the statues. I'm not sure if we're close or not. This would be them. Gonna look at the map. I don't know. I don't know where the fuck we are. <laughs> and with that, I, mean, I think I've we're gonna through- actually finish the session better. there. Cause we've been going for a lot longer than I think we normally do. Well, we yeah, didn't we... start until like two thirty ish, so we've been going for like three hours. Yeah, a good three hours. Too unusual yeah. for us, but Not it is unusual. getting a little late in the day. Yes, yeah. which is why I think it's a good enough time as any to call yeah, the yes. session for the day. Next time, yeah. uh, I need to think of a puzzle for you guys to. Uh, Ooh, solve in order mm. to get mm-hmm. into Vildash. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Also, for prep for next session, uh, what is the issue that is plaguing the library with which, like, what is the conflict that needs to be resolved? That will tell you how to populate the dungeon or place with monsters. Like, is it going to be an infestation of mimics? Is there going to be a bunch of undead? 
Is it oozes coming up from the fucking floorboards? Ew, floor you know, oozes. All of the above in different amounts. I mean, I had a creature that I thought up at work that I thought was pretty neat, so it'll probably have something to do with that. <laughs> An undead ooze mimic. No. My no. god. <laughs> Kill it before it multiplies. <laughs> anyway. Bye bye. Bye, chat, and whoever else is still here on the stream. <laughs>